You're not going to microwave this hedgehog, are you? <laughs> oh. I don't think we have any microwaves in space, so you might be uh, safe for now. Can't, how's everyone doing? It's hey. talking about how great the Kickstarter looks, and thank you so much for featuring me as the main character. Well, oh, you're welcome, question mark. Yeah. <laughs> it's an honor, honestly. This project looks so freaking cool, and I'm glad that Bo can be a part of it. <laughs> you know what? And anyone can see themselves uh in that little rackling by the pond. So uh yeah, that's I'm uh... sure that they could, you know, but it, it is Bo. But it's not them, <laughs> let's be honest. It's Bo. Mm -hmm. It is Bo. Mm -hmm. So true. Well, it could be Bo. If you sure. donate to the Kickstarter, I got nothing. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> Where is my map? You super suit, oh. super suit, <laughs> super suit. Uh, my Uber Eats driver apparently called and left a voicemail to let them let me know that uh, they're on their way. Which yikes! Is huh? Who does this? Don't like what it. What the hell? The Don't like second right? delivery of the driver ever. <laughs> What? I don't like that. Like before like they, they fucking you. like lose that like sh the shine in their eye. Yeah. Like the... Boy, that is weird. Don't like it. I don't like it. Uh, Wait. Of... Yes. What did they do? They told you they're coming. Like, they called they actually and left called. a voicemail saying that they, they were on their way. Oh. You see the uh, best okay, delivery drivers. Sometimes yeah. I'll get the notification <laughs> that they're on their way, and I'll even like peer at the road, and I'll never see them, and then I'll find out they somehow managed to sneak beyond my like underneath my peripheral vision, <laughs> drop the package, and then like bail into the tree line. I'm like, damn, that Can guy's real that guy gets it. Hmm. Yeah, go ahead and ask the, guys... the real question ever actually get warm food with your uber eats because no. no. yeah i do usually uh, yeah. i mean like i don't so know i, I mostly like order from places though. really so, yeah i had it like they have 18 different spots to go to before they get to me i had yeah a, i'm usually uh, the first one they hit i had an uber eats delivery driver had their battery in their car frequently die while they were trying to <laughs> deliver my food what? And when I told Uber Eats, they said, well, if you'd like, uh, we can cancel the order for a refund, or you can wait and see if the food's good, and we'll take 20% off the order. And I went, oh, you know what? We'll wait and what see. What the hell? And they, were like, and they were like, okay, and then just let us know if there's any issue. And I'm like, like, if the food's cold? And they were like, yes. And I went, okie dokie. So then I got the food. It was ice cold. It was the coldest food I have ever gotten in recent memory. I messaged Uber Eats. It was like, hey, this food is ice cold. I would like a full refund so I can reorder this food again. They said, ooh, sorry, you accepted the 20% off, so you we can't give you a refund. Like, they quartered me. And I was like, uh, no, that is not how that was presented. I would like my refund, please. And they said, we already gave you the solution. We're ending the conversation. And then Damn. ended the conversation. Damn, dude, you got fucking owned. Then I messaged Damn. a third guy was like, give me a refund, please. And explained everything. And they were like, yeah, here's your refund. I don't know what the heck that was about. Oh my God, dude. <laughs> Yeah, it's like oh, I, the the idea of paying full price for a meal and it's expensive yeah. and you get it. And not only is it not presented to you nicely, of course, because delivery, but it's usually fucking cold or yeah. lukewarm. And you're yeah. just like, I guess I'll deal with this. But you you, yeah. you should pay mildly less for lukewarm food. I got a door I dash driver keeps throwing my food down my chimney. <laughs> I don't right, know. Why, like, why I are you doing that? How many times I gotta tell him to stop doing hey, that? It's all sooty when it comes. I down. had a whole pizza flop right down onto the fireplace. Did you yes, eat sir. it? <laughs> One time it was clam chowder, which just ruined it. <laughs> <laughs> I just didn't enjoy eating it so much, but when I finally finished it, <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> All right, I'm taking you Ooh, to the map. Is this ambient like noise? Yeah, mm -hmm. it's ambient noise. Mm -hmm. How did you get ambient spaceship noise? <laughs> the internet. <laughs> just... <laughs> the 
Yeah, if I had to find a fucking spaceship real, and record it, how did you get this? What are you doing from there? <laughs> from space, obviously. Listen, I got brain fog. Okay? <laughs> No, this is really what being in space sounds like, Lena. It sounds good. Oh, yeah. Let me, let me move uh, Toots over because Toots was with you guys the entire time. Oh, yeah. I remember thinking back now. They were yeah. there. Yeah, they were there's there. Toots. And went, hey, oh. it's me, Toots. All right. Let's go ahead and do a brief recap. I know it's been a couple of weeks. Not much has happened from the last session, but I will give you guys the heads up of what's going on because I know we were also missing Lena, who is back and better than ever. Hi. Big <laughs> round of applause. You beat it. Wait, oh, yeah. Woohoo! Okay, she made okay, it. Yeah, yeah. Okay, thank you. <laughs> you beat the plague. We're so proud good of work. you. Yeah, it's good to be back. All right. <laughs> last session. Ooh. I just realized what the last session was. Oh my god! How did I? How did I forget? How did I forget? Um, so last session, you guys uh, finished your fight in the maintenance bar that was underneath the station, uh, facing off uh, against. Bu -bu 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 -bu. Need to pull up my notes. Need to pull up uh, Demi Draconian. Um, there seemed to have been some confusion of who actually Demi Draconian was, uh, as apparently, uh, according to Demi Draconian, yes, uh, the kobold in the corner was Demi Draconian, uh, that you guys were fighting off against. Uh, so, uh, clearly making sure that you guys were capturing the correct Demi Draconian, you killed, uh, the Draconian. Uh, that pointed and told who Demi Draconian was along with and just wiped out the, the rest of the crew, capturing Demi Draconian, quote unquote. It wasn't until you realized, once you arrived back over to Desperado, uh, that this little kobold, surprise, surprise, was not Demi Draconian, but apparently was pretending to be as he started to spread rumors amongst the ship about how Desperado was no more. So as a... Uh, as a, a peace offering, this little kobold stated that uh, that they would go ahead and, and, and calm things over and make sure to build the reputation back for Desperado so that way Desperado can resume business amongst the cartel that is here in the Omno Station. Uh, with your job completed, Shrug, uh, you guys were paid, uh, each of you, 400 credits, a total of 2,000 credits total. And you were all um, given uh, a little bit of insight about the second job uh, that Desperado is looking for. But essentially, Desperado is seeking those that can go to an abandoned station from a long time ago uh, to get old world fuel, as he calls it, uh, so that you guys yeah. can take the fuel uh, over, uh, over here to the Omno station, uh, uh, Desperado has his own way to process it to encourage energy fuel and is willing to pay you per barrel. You know how many that you'd be able to fill. Uh, did I give you guys the exact numbers of those? Uh... You did, but I don't know. If I you wouldn't did. remember. Oh, no, it's fine. I just want to make sure that I did actually you give you You definitely did list out what the number would be. I can give you the number once I'm here. Du -du 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 -du. There it is. Okay. Uh, so if you guys uh, were to take the job, which it sounded like, which you guys uh, were interested in taking, uh, Desperado is willing to pay 200 credits uh, per canister filled. Uh, the total pay, um, your the ticket can hold a total of 36 canisters of old world fuel. If you manage to bring all 36 canisters back to the Omno station and sell it to Desperado, uh, you will earn a... Nice, neat, 7,200 Ooh. credits. Not bad, not Ooh. bad. All right, all right. Not bad at all. And then nothing else happened. Just kidding. Uh, you guys went to Clert Mart, which was over on this station, oh. uh, where uh, I don't know if you guys were causing trouble or the Clert Mart employees were causing trouble. Not sure. There was, a, it was, there was a lot of tomfoolery, I think. There was a everyone. lot of tomfoolery. I don't think anyone is blameless here. Yes. Um, but you guys did buy some... Uh, <laughs> what was it called? Well, we bought some discount. like Discount. Whole, like a big pile of yeah, expired wholesale potions. potions. Wholesale potions. <laughs> yeah. Yes. 
Uh, discounted, uh, uh, I believe you guys actually bought discounted superior potions, I want to say. Um, let me check Zug's inventory. I think we also bought weed, too. Oh, yeah, mm -hmm. for 50 credits. It's under the yeah. table. Yeah, that that was not as official. Yeah, what kind of mechanical bonuses do you get? From, <laughs> like, fuck it, getting absolutely sucked. White Pre cheddar cheesy puffs, too. Mm -hmm. Oh, white cheddar mm. cheesy puffs are the best. Mm. But you guys did What's just... What's this chirping noise? Hmm? There's no chirping yeah, noise. That's the, that's the space. <laughs> no, no, space. no, no, no. Well, man, you taught people how to do a chirping noise? <laughs> huh? Yeah, so you can do this chirping noise with your fingers. It sounds kind of like a cricket or like sort of like a... <laughs> like it's a, it's a weird sound nice, that you come can... Come on. <laughs> you can't... I'm not gonna do it, guys. Come on. <laughs> the, no. the second they started laughing, it was over. Yeah. Because oh, yeah, I was I about to fall for it again. I was about to until he brought up the fingers. I was thinking, wait, we can do a chirping noise? <laughs> It's because we already did this bit. Like, yeah, that's why I was like, like am I Lena, losing my fucking mind? The fact of the matter is, a couple people in this, a couple people in this call got owned by Lawman so hard that I don't know how the fuck they still show their face in these okay, well, like, bad. It. Well, I have to. Like, I don't really have a choice in the Brett matter. Brett has to. Yeah. Okay. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. You got. I think. I think you got it the worst, actually. So maybe you like. Maybe you no, like. I, no, the I did it. No, I did it. <laughs> Damn, I missed a lot. Okay. <laughs> that, 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 no, you did it. That was kinda, it. I just kind of, I, I, I pranked, I pranked the buttons. I pranked the buttons. You're, You're just, lucky. Okay, okay. You just got the rundown. Um, so, bu, 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 bu. all right, let me check everyone's inventory. Cause I think I, yep, there we go. Oh gosh. How many of those potions did you buy? I'm also making sure that, all right, 400 credits is in Bo's inventory as well. Well, thank you. My burger will be here in like one minute, so no, it's all good. Okay. It's all good. Um, when are you grabbing your burger? Uh, it is literally one minute away and watching them pull up the street. Okay. Do you want to go grab, grab your burger? Because I'm going to grab my food. Yes! <gasps> Same time? Okay, yeah. one, two, three, go. Yeah, I'll see you guys oh later. God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm gonna like, I'm, I guess I'll, yeah. Yeah, uh, Tomato, if you can DM for me, I'd appreciate it. <laughs> tomato, give me a level up! Oh, uh, fuck. Okay. We're hot, my like, huh? You start seeing the glass in the middle of the room crack. <laughs> um, I'm playing, uh, I'm playing Skarl Shadow Walk. Uh, uh, make a constitution he's a, saving throw. He's, he sits in the corner. He has his hood up. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna need him. I've changed it. Make an um, intelligence saving throw. Yeah, okay. Uh, what do he, you get? Let's see here. I'm, I'm gonna have to roll on my other character sheet, okay. unfortunately. This uh, lady on the bench is uh, casting um, some kind of Scarl, incantation. Scarl Ooh. Shadow Walk rolled a uh, six. All right, they casted Feeble Mind on you because they had the spell slot and they're about to take a long rest and thought it'd be funny because they perceive you to be simply nothing more than a passing by NPC. Uh, Holy shit. So your character is unfortunately now essentially brain dead for the next 30 days until someone uses to pay the rest of the day. Fuck! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Yeah. Spend all this fucking they... time on this character sheet. <laughs> <laughs> they look over at their party and they go off to have a real adventure after just totally dunking on us. <laughs> and then you yeah. woke up as you ended huh? that daydream of whatever the fuck just happened. That guy looked nuts. He had like, like, you know where you bleach your hair, but it's like. Are you talking about your delivery orange. person? <laughs> yeah. It was like. Yeah. Orange, like no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, and, but but like 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 uh that like was really trendy orange. at my high school where, where dudes fuck? would like bleach their hair like a really weird shade of yellow like a really yeah. specific one yeah like yellow orange and he just like rocked up no eye contact loud ass fucking music i like, haven't like, that was weird i haven't seen a delivery guy that's actually delivered my food in some time the last one i saw i shit you not if i hadn't double if i hadn't done a double take i would have thought it was guy fieri uh, <laughs> hey. coming, like out of flavor town to give me some dude one time did, one did time he, i got cussed out pizza? by a rami malik look-alike why what'd you do i didn't hear i didn't do anything he was like i don't know we were we got off at the bus at the same time and he was like he was like he, uh, he was like people. looking 
Yeah, he was like looking, it was a public bus, obviously. He was like looking back at the bus and he was like cursing under his breath. And I was like, I was like, yo, did oh. you leave your phone or something? And he was like, you fucking stole it. I was like, what? Here, here, here's, what, here's why I'm stupid is because I, I, I laughed at the crackhead. Um, and then, <laughs> <laughs> and then, and then he was like, fuck you, bitch. And he walked across oh the street. Oh my God. <laughs> Holy shouldn't shit. have stole his phone, oh, yeah. dude. I shouldn't have stolen his phone, I guess. You had that one coming. Yeah. He didn't even try to fight for it, though, which was extremely fortunate. Did, is that what you said? Were you like, yeah, what are you going to do about a bitch? And then you threw your fist <laughs> up, and you're like... Yeah. <laughs> I guess I'm just naturally that imposing. You he didn't really even want to like challenge me. Yeah. But oh. did you also get Taco Bell, but that was like five minutes ago, and you already got it in your hands right now? No, don't worry about it. How many cheesy roll ups oh did you get? God. Be honest. Yeah, Zero. let us know how many cheesy roll ups <laughs> got loaded up in that bag. Why would I do that? <laughs> <laughs> I haven't eaten yet. Although my cheesy gordita crunch, they didn't deliver it. And that's what I really wanted. So I'm really. <laughs> no! Yeah, that's yeah. so sad. Did you pay for it and they didn't give it to you? I don't know. I'm Time to get a full refund. I don't know, ma'am. I don't and then, know. And then I got Mountain Dew, and this is definitely Diet Mountain Dew. And I feel a little insulted by that because. What is Diet Mountain Dew? What? Mm -hmm. You oh. Americans! And I'm gonna shake my fist. What? At what? What do you mean? <laughs> we um, love our aspartame, all right? It's glory to cheeseburger us, country! Like I don't Mountain drink Dew. soda. I just wanted a Mountain Dew, and this is Diet Mountain Dew. How could you tell? Oh, man. I love, love the aspartame. aspartame. Yeah. I can't tell shit. I don't... Hey, Ken. You just gotta put... You, your, your mind to it, and you can do whatever you want. Huh. I, I believe in you. Well, I was hoping this conversation would last longer, but since it's not, I'll leave Wait, my tacos really? to the side. Oh. <laughs> uh, no, did you, you know how many water bottles I got in the States that had Ooh. ingredients in it? No, tell me. Tell us all. Just about all of oh. them. Why is yeah, you know what? You know what? Whatever, Lena. Cheeseburger country could buy New Zealand. I hope you realize yeah, that. Yeah, fuck you. Yeah, ne next time you what talk shit you know about <laughs> cheeseburger land, we'll just buy you out. Yo, Lena, what do you think about that? Be elaborate as possible. Yeah. Um. You know what? B -b buying New Zealand out, you guys? Wait, never, are you also eating? Would never. Don't worry about it. I am it. eating. Never. Oh, okay. Who? Um, Which one? Are both of us? Everyone? Yeah, Everyone's yeah. We're, eating. We're both just very Everyone is impressive. eating. Uh, right. Let's see. I took a call this morning. Uh, I've been getting this call Ugh. from Florida like every single day for the past week. And I was like, oh. no, it's not you. It wasn't you, Brett. It wasn't you this time. Um, I got I got really into like scam baiting content on YouTube. So I was like, there's no fucking way I'm picking up this call. It's definitely some kind of scammer. So I ignored it and I ignored it and I ignored it for like two weeks. Uh, and I finally like answered it this morning because I was like, I was sick and tired of my phone going off. And uh, and it was and it was a fucking it was a bill that I didn't know I had from uh -oh. Amazon. <laughs> uh -oh. And I had like, like like racked up overdue fees on it too. And, and not only that, but they also sent me letters about it. Uh, yeah, like we thought like you in were the mail. Dead. In the <laughs> yeah, in the mail, and I even took them inside. But because they were from Amazon, I was like, oh okay, this is there's some stupid fucking Amazon promotion. I'm not gonna open this. Yeah. And, <laughs> I racked like up like fifty dollars. That's how they get you, though. Is that like at the same time, if you fucking sent me a letter from Amazon that said in big red bold letters, "Open mm -hmm. this, please, God, urgent. You must yeah. open this." Yeah, I'd be I like, know. "Huh, that's a fucking huh. card in there." Exactly. Yeah, right. Yeah. yeah, right. There's nothing you can do. You'd have to. You'd have to basically have someone in person show up at my door, knock on it with like a clipboard to get my attention at this point. Yeah, and this whole fucking time, I was listening to this lady tell me, like, uh, like uh, about what I had to do to pay off the bill. And this whole time, I'm sitting there, and I'm like, okay, okay. Next, she's going to tell me to log into my bank account and download fucking, you know, the thing that lets you see their PC. And she never did. And she was like, okay, I'm sorry for taking so much of your time. Have a good day. And I was like, oh, fuck, I actually have an overdue bill. Yeah, it's but real? what if you just, what if the scam was just so elaborate that they actually managed to ban no, you? No, it's and fine. You the whole she bought the Google here. Play cards and she gave it to him. The death <laughs> gone. <laughs> All right. I'm ready to begin. I, yeah, I think Amazon would use their better. website to alarm you <laughs> of a bill. 
<laughs> it, it was fucking stupid, man. But I, I enrolled in electronic updates instead of letters because I barely check my email or my mailbox anyways. Am Amazon bad. also <laughs> just has the tendency to be like, I don't know. Yeah, sure. Here's a refund. I, they did that once for a uh, CPU I bought when I was building my computer. Mm -hmm. And they said the CPU was delivered, but there was no picture and we, and we never got the CPU. So I called them and was like, hey, never got this $900 CPU. And they're like, one moment, please. And they're like, dude, I hear you. Cause one time they sent me a, I, I ordered a 50 gallon aquarium and it got sent um, to me completely shattered, oh, but they, they refunded it like immediately. No. So they refunded the CPU and then said, all right. Did you like check or something? It was like, yeah, we, we checked. We, we checked everything. And okay, well then here's the refund. And if you still end up getting the CPU, don't worry about it. You can just keep it. I was like, Aww. okay. Awesome. Oh. I mean, like, what are they gonna do to like, I mean, obviously, like what are they gonna do to enforce that? Like, just call you like the next, did you and, get it yet? Oh, then, you gotta return that. And then later, <laughs> I got mm -hmm. the CPU. Yo! Oh, I got a backup that's CPU. That's how you get them. That's how you yeah. get them. I, I wasn't trying to get anyone, but yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's how you get them, dude. Nah, no, stick it to the man. <laughs> I recently right. got a 20% off uh, coupon for any purchases from the Blizzard gear store because mm -hmm. they delayed my... Uh, my giant fuck off fifteen hundred dollar uh, Lich King sword. Oh, you did get that. <laughs> oh, that kicks <laughs> ass. Oh my god. <laughs> what? And so they delayed that, and they're like, "All right, we're gonna give you just a twenty percent off of your next purchase. Anything you want. Uh, sorry." And I'm like, "Man, how about the sword? I Buy don't have sword. any replica swords yet. Yeah, I wait, should wait, get wait, one. Do you not get the sword? Are you still not getting I'm it? St I'm getting the sword, but there, it's, it's just be, a little later. It's mm, two months from now instead of huh. soon. Yeah. Oh, Do you man, have furniture for the rest of your house yet, or did you get a sword first? No sword, of course. <laughs> sword. Why would you ever get anything but the sword? <laughs> <laughs> I got, boys, I got I the sword forever ago. I, I don't know. Uh huh. I, I've How do men one... live like this? I had one weird Amazon thing where I ordered an SSD from them, like something so fucking basic, like three years ago, and they delivered me a wholesale pallet of SSDs, and I didn't what? know what to do. Yeah, I was like eight <laughs> instead of one. It was like five hundred dollar SSDs, and I like call them. I'm like, you guys sent me eight of these things in this <laughs> big giant box, and they were like, we'll look into that. They didn't ask me to send the back. They're like, we'll look at it. We'll take a look. I never hear anything back for three years and I still haven't. But it's like this box of cursed goods where I feel like the second I open this fucking Ark of the Covenant, like immediately some Amazon like employee is going to pour out of a crawl space and be like, what the fuck are you doing with that illegally obtained SSD hardware? And then We're looking the into it. <laughs> You're being tested by some entity, I think. All right, guys. Or did you eat your entire Taco Bell? I'm, I'm, I'm stuffing it down my face, but it's fine because I'm ready to go. So we're ready. Okay. You guys, it's been a while. It's ready. Let's get to Dungeons and Dragons. Wow. You guys are currently at the Omno Station Promenade. Uh, hold on. Oh my god. <laughs> and of course, eating more. Hold on. <laughs> No, I'm burpy because I always literally another all the food. Yeah, just put it down Shoving tacos fast. down your throat and makes you a little, a little burpy. <laughs> Make me a little gassy. Um, but no, you guys uh, went through the maintenance tunnels. Um, you managed to time the tram just right to arrive over at the promenade. And now we're going to do some, some lovely recapping of what you guys can do over here. Uh, your options, of course, is you can shop around here. Uh, but once you are ready to go, uh, let me know, and then you guys will return back to the ticket, uh, where if you are ready to take the job, head over to this abandoned space station. Now, keep in mind that this space station um, is a considered trespassing of the Ionian government. You are not supposed to be at this station. So with but you will be given all the instructions of how to get there without... Um, without being detected because there are also security buoys all around the station. And if you uh, pass the the perimeter, um, it alerts the Ionia Navy, which will then arrive at the station. So, but first, promenade. A, a recap of what you guys can shop here. Uh, over here is a sort of general store slash 
weapons and armor, uh, things that you might be able to get. And they have a rotating stock depending because this is a trade station. It does, uh, it does frequently go through the stock. So every week new goods are sold along with uh, any mundane item that you wish. Uh, over here is a pet shop specifically for pets that can survive over oh, oh. in space stations. Oh. <laughs> and then finally, we have a ship, uh, a sort of like ship ordering depot where you can get parts for your ship. And then finally, uh, a place called the Bounty Board, uh, which is located right over here. And, uh, mm. and yeah, so uh, with that said, where would you guys like to go? First time, like the bomb when he leaves, he's like looking around to see if there's like a trail of rats. Oh yeah, like, there's droppings. rat droppings just scattered all down here because the last thing you guys saw was oh the clerk mascot running as it just it covered in rats. Uh. uh, Bo looks up and he does that thing like when cats get really excited, like when they're gonna pounce and their eyes get real teeny tiny and they look really <laughs> scary, and then they grow double in size. And then he puts his nose right on the ground and his ass in the air, and he just starts going this way. All right. Bo is now walking off. Did, did he can find I, food? Can I check my wallet, Brett? Yeah, you can check your wallet. What, what am I sitting on here? You're sitting on 191 credits. Ooh, kind of low. Yeah, you also bought like a, a case of uh, discounted uh, yeah, healing yeah. potions. I think I'm done here I don't got any more money <laughs> oh here hold mine I give you all my money <laughs> all right which <laughs> is 465 all right so you have now six 465 oh, that's 406 so 465 so 657 credits is oh. what you have currently thanks brother I would lose it if I kept that. Uh, should we? Maybe the ship parts store has something cool. Yeah, we could probably get like a soft upgrade or something. I was gonna go see where the rats went. I'm gonna catch up with Bo. I don't like that look. I'm just gonna take okay. a quick peek around <clears throat> the corner. I want to see if that guy's dead. Bo like sense the spell set coming from behind and he turns oh, around. Nothing here. Um so yeah, as, so uh we'll pause on this moment of what you guys will see as you cross around the corner. Um <laughs> but uh we're gonna go over to Felsic, who is approaching Bo. Uh something catch your eye, little bro. He looks up and his ears perk up and his tail kind of like gets real floofy, and he steps very gently over to Felsec and like looks up at her and puts his hand in hers and just tugs it <sighs> tugging and tugging all right yeah yeah yeah. okay all right let's go shopping this is the pet store right <clears throat> that is correct okay. uh, you will walk in uh, to see a dragonborn uh kind of like filling in this like kibble spot um that's underneath the table as you walk in you'll hear the sound of the bells ding, 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 ding. and she'll look up and say ah customer welcome welcome how may I help uh, you today? Hey, Tots, I smell a bit of stuff uh, in here. What, what do we got here? What, what is this place? The... Oh, well, uh, we uh, adopt uh, little friends out here uh, for your space travels. These are all creatures uh, that are able to handle uh, the stresses of space and work well in your ship. Hey, Bo. Psst. Hmm. Bo, hmm. If, you're, if you're hungry... I literally, I bought cheesy puffs. <gasps> At, uh, we don't, that is we correct. <laughs> These are friends, not food. What kind of friends you got? What kind of cheesy puffs you got? Well, we do have a rotating stock monthly. Um, but this month we have for our little friends. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba, ba -ba. I had it here and then I didn't. Whoops. While well, while he's doing that, oh there it is. Bo yeah, go on. Goes up to Felsec and starts like putting his tiny grimy little raccoon paws all over her like I don't bag or pockets, looking for cheesy puffs. 
Yeah, okay, yeah, I'll, I'll take out a single cheesy puff and offer it. Like a, like, I don't know. <laughs> so currently we like have- Like I'm feeding a small creepy creature. So we don't have it here, of course, but it, it'll be stored below deck. Uh, we currently have the following. A rat, a hedgehog, a snake, and a rabbit. And then she's like Bo tapping into the, the short shard screen. Bo takes a cheesy poof and goes, Ah, okay. Ah, uh, Felsa, what do you think about getting one of those? You should get a rat. Mm hmm. How big are your rats? Uh, a, a normal size. It says normal what? size. What? It's wait, wait, wait. It's just like a normal rat? Uh, it is a rat that can handle itself in spaceships, yes. Okay, so it's like a normal rat. But it was born mm. here in space. <laughs> so, so what? Does it have, like, space, like, telepathic powers now? Or is it just a rat? No, we can just handle the stresses of space. This, this is its natural environment. Okay. Bo, let and me know when you're gonna buy something. We can put it outside the ship. We can handle space. Oh, uh, I would not put it outside the ship, no. It has a space rat. It can handle space environments like a spaceship, not outside of space. That'll kill everything. Ah. Uh, okay. I suppose I you could give it a of... little rat spacesuit, I suppose. That would be cute. Oh! Did you hear that, Felsa? We can give him a spacesuit. Uh, we don't have that, though. That'd be up to something you'd have to make yourself. But also, uh. at the same time, not certain why you'd want to put the rat through so much stress. Bo, Bo, do you want to buy a rat, or do you just want to, like, scrounge around the satellite and find one? Well, if I'm we sorry? got ourselves... <clears throat> yep. Uh, what did you say? No, just uh, give us a, a moment. That's, uh, hang on. One, oh, one apologies. Uh, <clears throat> now, we could, we could grab ourselves, uh, we can get a hedgehog, and then, and then we can get a rat, and we can get two. Both of them, you know. <laughs> yeah. Wow. I didn't think about it that way. We can really get two, can't we? Yeah. Yeah. We we give the space suit to the hedgehog, <laughs> and then that we go get a rat, and then we give that one a space suit. And we, we can yeah. get two. two. You're so right, Bo. I you're speaking yeah. my language. I'm here with you on this one. Let's buy a hedgehog. Okay. Do you have a name? We got okay. we got to think of a name. I was gonna ask you the same thing. Oh, oh shit! Hey, oh, can I buy yeah. a hedgehog off? Can I pawn a hedgehog off of you? Pawn a hedgehog? What? What do you mean? Like, um, uh, like I'll give you money and you give me the hedgehog. Ah, uh, yes, you can go ahead and adopt a hedgehog. Yes, that is okay. very well possible. Uh, that'll be five hundred credits, please. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> Sorry. No need to be rude. Uh, it handles uh, all of the vaccinations and shots that your hedgehog will be required. Is it is it like spayed or neutered? It'll it'll be spayed and or neutered. Okay, that's good. That's ethical. Both jumps you on know, the counter because we've had such like a uh, like like people will get like pet hedgehogs and then they'll like they'll oh, like dear. not care about and then like release them and then they'll like breed with other released hedgehogs oh, and it creates like an epidemic of like hedgehogs. I understand. That is uh, I'm, it seems you have a good eye for this. Mm -hmm. You'll mm -hmm. be an excellent hedgehog owner. Uh, we you also register your hedgehog into the system. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna look helplessly at Bo. <laughs> Five on. Get me out of um. here. Hi, <laughs> uh. right. Can you reach in my pocket? Cause you tell me well, mm, how much do I have? I'm supposed to, like still chewing on the freaking oh, singular Bo? cheese. Right. How much? How much money does Bo have? Bo has 400 credits from uh, what you accomplished with Desperado. Uh, wait, shouldn't I have more than that? I've barely spent any money this entire th year. You're also butt naked. Yeah, what does that have, have to really do with anything, to Brett? Any Where are you though? keeping your money? Yeah. That's a great question. I, I'd I also like to, to tell you that is yes, private you information. Uh, uh, I'm going to be touching it, Bo. All right, hold on. <laughs> now, let me, let me double check. Um, ba, 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 ba. I, I Yo, I, have... I, I, oh, this is fucked. Okay. After checking the wealth, first of all, Belsic, uh, uh, you have upon you. I need to go uh, ahead and bust the calculator out for this. I'm just moving all of your credits over to. Hey, it's it's all good. I have no idea how much money I have, so no, I was going to ask at some point, anyways. Yes, that works. So uh, you have 
Felsic has 1,814 credits. Damn. Yeah, that's Come what on. I thought. And here's used to be a lot more than that. Here's <laughs> <laughs> won't be long now until you're down here with the rest of us, huh? Um, <laughs> Poe, <laughs> this is where it gets a little fucked. Bo has 500 credits perfectly. Oh my god. <clears throat> Bo hops off the counter, goes behind Felsack, and he says, Hey. Yeah? Hey, uh, I got 500 credits, but, uh, you think they got any hats? Hats? Like for, yeah. like, hedgehog sized or rackling sized? No, no, no. For the hedgehog. We gotta get him a hat, but I don't have that much uh, money. We can just... I, I, I'll I, make... I'll make the hedgehog a hat, Bo. You can make hats? I'll learn how, Bo. Excuse me, did you say you were gonna turn the hedgehog into a hat? Uh, no, 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 no. You see, I wanna... I mean, you know, that is that an option? No, no. I wanna put it... Turning the hedgehog into a hat? Absolutely not. Hey, Bo, no. have you ever bought a gun before? <laughs> <laughs> We're uh, starting to raise some serious red flags, and if we don't, like, just get it done and get out of here, like, they're not gonna let us buy the hedgehog, okay? She's staring at you because of the question, have you ever bought a gun before? <laughs> so, Bo takes a few more steps towards towards him and puts out his hands in a little grimy paw way and says, Hey, uh, one hedgehog, please. Do you have the, uh, are you paying the 500 credits? Do you have any hats? <laughs> Jesus. We. I used to think the bomb and Jurassic were the most wild two person <laughs> group to just go off on their own. We <laughs> do not sell hats now, but there's a general store next door if you'd like. Ah, uh, okay, does this adoption uh, come with any stuff, you know, accessories, uh, you know, toys, uh, food, uh, you yes, know? Yes, 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 of course. You would get a month's serving of hedgehog food. It's tiny mm. little kibble here, and it works if it's perfectly in any sort of receptacle. Uh, your hedgehog will be spayed and or neutered uh, and have all of their vaccinations and shots. Uh, you will mm. also have, uh, the, this fee also covers the registration fee for the hedgehog, so that way you can come to and from port with uh, this creature in tow. It will actually be registered, so you don't have to worry about customs or anything like that. Oh, cool, we got a registered hedgehog? Not yet, <laughs> you haven't done it. <laughs> That's the only that registered thing we've fucking... got! <laughs> <laughs> but, so just a, can we like sidebar we here real quick, Brett? It, mm. uh, Bo still can't do his stretchiness on command, right? It's not a, a thing yet, right? Uh, not yet, no. Okay, okay. Uh, Bo, as he's holding out both of his hands, kind of like sporadically shakes his head. And then he cocks it to one side and then he puts his hand deep in his ear. And he takes out a few coins. And then oh. he kind of wiggles around and he takes a few coins out of his other ear and so then kind like of plastic chips of the credits. Yeah. Are they plastic chips? Yeah, okay. Yeah, they're they're, they're uh, credits, um, which is the currency of the of the world because you're in space. Pulls a few out of his nose and then a few out between his toes, and he puts it on the counter and he sits on the counter with the credits in front of him. So you are making the transaction of five hundred credits, is that correct? Yes, sir. All five hundred of them. Give me the hedgehog. <clears throat> uh she'll <laughs> Uh, so, Terrell will look over at the credits kind of scattered and covered in a variety of bodily excrements and will sort of put on little plastic gloves, scoot them over <laughs> into a little, like, poopy bag that you would put for, like, little <laughs> dogs, you oh. know? She'd kind of scoot that right in the bag, place it <laughs> underneath the desk. She'll type, start typing, and goes, okay, so we should have everything done in the next three days. Well, uh, hey! Huh? No, I want him now. Oh, I'm I'm sorry. We still have to spade and or neuter. Uh, <laughs> give the vaccinations and registrations. These, this all takes time, I'm afraid. Bo jumps off the counter and goes up to Felsic. Hey. Is it three days? What do we do? We'll be back in three days anyways. We will? We're not going to space? We are go- Fuck, I don't, I don't know, Bo. This is your hedgehog. <laughs> I, I, I tuned out. 
Like a minute ago. You think the boys will understand that we gotta wait here for a few days because we gotta take home We're not boys? waiting here for a few days. We'll be back. And, and what oh. are they gonna do after three days? Euthanize the hedgehog? Probably not. Yeah, you know, they do that. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, well, yep, they do that? <laughs> <laughs> well, once you, once you buy it, it's used, you know? Like, it's, it's, uh, it's not good for them anymore. <laughs> but, wait, but then we can buy it at a discount because it's, it's like, like, used like when you take a hedgehog. car out and it's used if it's anything right out of the... Absolutely not. We do not euthanize the hedgehog. That isn't at okay. least until three months. What the fuck are you saying, Bo? All right, you're, is your thing done? I'm out of I'm here. Yeah, I'm done. I, okay, well, we'll see you later. Thanks. Oh, what do you want to name? What do you want to name the hedgehog? Uh, so I can put that in the registration, so you're not take, spending uh, too much time. Uh, uh, I have a suggestion. Not what yet? What? Huh? Microwave. Huh? <laughs> microwave. <laughs> Micro <laughs> microwave. Where, where do you get that idea from? Because it's small. <laughs> microwave. Okay. Uh, pretty little lady over here would like her, his first name to be Micro and his uh, last name to be Wave. A silence falls over at the shop counter before she <laughs> leans over to you, Bo, and just says deeply under her breath, You're not going to microwave this hedgehog, are you? <laughs> oh. I don't think we have any microwaves in space, so we might be uh, safe for now. No, 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 no. But what if there were microwaves in space? You're not going to microwave- I don't know what if I had a million uh, bucks. What? She will what? lean underneath the counter, hand you back the 500 credits, and say, perhaps you aren't ready to make this adoption. Hey, no, I won't, I won't, I won't microwave him. I, 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 look, I'm just a little bit nervous. I never had my own little little guy. Uh, I'll treat, I No microwaves will be used at any point in time. Bo, I need you to make a persuasion check. Oh my God! <laughs> Actions have consequences, and your words have power. <laughs> okay, persuasion, uh, charisma, or uh, it it's just okay. if you mouse over skills, you will see oh, persuasion uh, next to okay. performance. Please, 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 please. Ooh. She shakes her head and says, "I understand that you're nervous, but this is a big responsibility, and with." Your actions that you would take while you were nervous, I'd be concerned. Uh, maybe come back. How, how about this? I, 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 I am not without, without favor. How about you return in a month's time? If you return and you're still interested in adopting the hedgehog, we can make the transaction then. And then she puts the, the poopy bag of credits right in front of you. He takes the poopy bag, and he hangs his head in shame. And he goes towards the door, and he looks back and just says, I'll be back for microwave. <laughs> she, <that's> like, <laughs> and then you'll, uh, you'll walk out. What is Bo's demeanor currently? He's a little bit upset, but also very down. He just doesn't even look up at anyone. He's just tail between his legs. Hey. Hey, Bo, we'll earn it, okay? We just gotta prove to them that we can be a responsible pet owner. We could have had a hedgehog right now, you know? No, actually you wouldn't have. You would have had it in like three days. No, we gotta wait a month because you said microwave. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. Damn. <laughs> All right. Uh, so, now that that has happened, the ball... Hey, Zug, you want to derail? <laughs> What's um, going on over here? What's going on over here? <laughs> We're derailing, Zug! <laughs> uh, um, Drask and the bomb. Uh, you will see 
up oh, sorry uh you whoa, will whoa. see <laughs> whoa. uh you will see this body lying before you oh it seems are they like dead are they like torn up <laughs> oh yeah there, there's definitely been some nibbles and tears and as you kind of see like the stitching and stuffing kind of like torn out of it hey, are there uh, still rats here uh a couple here and there they've all gathered around this uh this trash can you want to poke him or should I? Yeah, I was going to get like a stick and poke him, see if he's okay. Careful, rats might explode out of him. I can fight a rat. I can maybe fight like seven at once, I think. We have fought rats. I sort of jab. His head falls off. <laughs> oh, he's dead. Do we hide him in that pot? Um... I do not know what to do. I don't know if I... Are you kidding me? Um, well, we uh, do we just leave him here? I think maybe we just leave them here. Okay, could this, this be seems... traced back to us? There were cameras, yeah? Those, no, I... The rats took him. I okay, then we're fine. To do with it. Although fact... I was playing instruments with... Maybe we just get rid of those cameras. Do you think if we go back into that store, they know where the security feed is? We could erase. Okay, okay. We tell him that we saw him selling weed. We need to erase the tapes because we don't want him to get in trouble. Yeah. Exactly. Brett, is there like a body in here? Or did the rats devour the entire body <laughs> around this mascot suit? Now that you finally have taken a look, you find that it's actually a mascot suit completely empty. Is there blood in it? No, nope, there is no body. It looks like it was stripped <laughs> so, off in a very quick fashion. Okay. Rats scattered out. Oh God, they ate there him entirely. Is, there is a oh yeah, that's gonna. <laughs> there's a that's naked Clarent Mart worker running around the station right now. I'll be the I'll be the judge of that. He got eaten. <laughs> there's. Damn. They, they ate him down to the bone. There's not even any blood in the suit. I think we need to take this and hide it. I have an idea. Yeah? The bomb's just gonna get this. He's gonna put the suit on. <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna cover our tracks really quick. It's gonna whip the suit on, walk back to Court Mart. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, you'll watch as the Clarent Mart mascot. Uh, gnarled up and chewed up and eaten is just walking over to you right now. Looking great, buddy. Oh wait, one second. Let me just let me just do something real quick. It's like I could just do this. Uh, there we go. Thanks. <laughs> Turns out he's okay. <laughs> Mom's gonna gonna walk in. Go right up to the front desk. Hey, so, um, I quit. <laughs> uh, can I get, can I get my pay? You know, I don't handle that. They electronically deposit your pay. Come on, man. I got chased out of the store by rats again. Look, as long as you promise not to talk about the rat rats, because as Clern always says, never talk about the rats. Yeah, I know. Do you have your account information or uh, a debit card or something? We could probably get that transferred over there. The bomb doesn't have a debit card, does he? He sure does. He does? Oh we my have god, a wait, oh my god, dude! Wait, 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 and then you'll watch as the the he just slides the card, and you'll see on the screen uh, your balance. 
which is half a credit, uh, <laughs> increases uh, immediately to a hundred and half a credit. Nice. Wow. And he hands your card back. So, like... <laughs> he looks up and down the suit. Yeah, we're not taking that back. Yeah, it's all bit up by rats. Yeah, just... You can toss it or something. It doesn't matter. Okay. <laughs> hey. Hey. Hey, guy. Guess guess who that is. Oh no. It's not fucking Talon again, is it? Are you? Uh, now you're as a good. Po- are you like Talon? You came from a Talon. Does that make you by proxy a Talon? No, it is me, the bomb. <laughs> right. I haven't moved my token, but at this point, Zug would be in the ship store. Okay. So, so while all this has happened, you went off to the ship store. Yeah. Right when all everyone right. split up the first time. All right. So we'll pause this scene over here i have done so many scams at this point that it's kind of unreal <laughs> that no one has stepped in and be like this is unacceptable conduct i mean how <laughs> how is it immoral true uh this is the ship uh, depot hello you'll walk in uh to see a shadow tiefling uh along with a guard oh, over here she's cute and she'll look over to you. Yeah, how can I help you? Ignored. Uh, I'm immediately looking around at all the things <laughs> that are cool and shiny. Wow. Wow. Ooh. Hello? <laughs> I touched the barrel of the gun. <laughs> touch the barrel of the gun? Ooh. Hey, hi. Don't how touch that. You? No, you. Hey. <laughs> he walks up. And like, what the fuck? <laughs> She's like, hey, that's okay. That's all right. It's not causing any trouble. <laughs> nice stuff here. Good machinery. Well, thanks. Did you make this yourself? Uh, these are all just display models. They aren't actually functional. Oh. She blinks. Looks kind of bummed. Yeah. And she's Where's, like, I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I'm just a retailer. I didn't build any of this. Uh, now he's just downright disappointed. Sorry. <sighs> well, so how can I help you? Um, I don't know. I just thought I might browse a little. Oh, okay. And then, so she'll see. She types something on our shard screen she moves the shard screen over and you'll see just a inventory of items and like uh like almost like a like an excel itemized list go ahead and page through what you want mm, i browse All what right. do we got out here uh so uh because this is a ship depot uh any ship part can be ordered uh the time will actually be the time will fluctuate depending on what you do order in, but you will see all classes of stuff. So real quick, I'm not going to give you a list because it is literally just quite literally everything. Um, but some of the things that you'll in be interested in from your ship, uh, currently your ship has no workstations, although you did manage to get the... Um, that artificer station that you're gonna get installed aboard the ship, not taking any expansion slots. Let me also look at that just to let you know what you've got. Uh, your weapons are extremely basic. Uh, so you're at the lowest tier of weapon. Uh, you have no like missile drives or anything of that nature. Uh, you have, I believe, checking. You have no aiming systems installed, which means you don't get uh, attack bonuses to your ship guns um, because you don't have any aiming systems. The propulsion shard's actually pretty good. You've got a uh, you've got a rare propulsion shard, um, that, but the next slot up would be very expensive. Uh, like I said, you have one weapon. 
You have, I believe, checking. Yep, you have one shield system. Uh, your EF storage is very basic, uh, your, but you do have one. Uh, EF storage allows you to travel farther. Uh, your oxygen supply lasts one week. Uh, you already have navigation. Your food production is the basic it can be, but if you wish to go ahead and expand upon that, you can actually start installing like um, like meals on that'll actually begin to generate. Uh, your FTL drive is, I think the lowest tier it is currently, yes. Um, and you don't have any extra plating over the ship. Uh, the next thing that you would be interested in, because you are actually, your ship is at its limit for all components you can install upon it. Um, your next uh, thing that you could purchase, you'll see a little, uh, little ship expansion um, that'll make your ship a little bit larger and, uh, and can install an additional component. Oh, how does that work? Does um, pay money, get ship expansion? Uh, yeah, well, well, it takes time. You can either get, you can either uh, do it yourself uh, or you could have the station install it and they do it at a pretty minimal fee because that's all handled by the Ionian government. So um, it's a very considerably low percentage. Um, the more you ship expansions you get, the more expensive it becomes. So right now you've got 12. Uh, uh, let me actually know. You might have checking your ship. You currently have 10 expansion slots. Uh, so to get your 11th uh, expansion slot will cost you 1,500 credits. Uh, okay. He wants that, but he can't have it. Yeah. So instead he goes to the next thing he wants, but maybe he can have. Okay, and what would that be? How much for this... Uh... Missile tube. Hmm? Well, that's a basic model there. Let me go ahead and calculate here. And she just kind of look, looks over at everything and says, eh, I don't recognize your face. She's looking at you. Because we've never met. Well, right, of course. But I mean, like, I haven't seen Hi, you I'm on the Zach. station. Nice to meet you. Oh, nice to meet you as well. And then she offers her hand. And she Thanks, says, Jake. and she says, uh, Tari, nice to meet you. So, and as she's kind of like tapping over there and she continues to, to type out, she looks and says, uh, we do have a basic missile launcher that I'm sure we can attach to your ship if you'd like. Let me see here. And she taps a little, a little bit more. And then she will say, oh, we got an off, we got an aftermarket one. Uh, typically it's a hundred credits, but I'll give you a, I'll give you the first time discount of 10%. It'll be 90 credits instead. Well, and this is like functional right away. I just put this on and... Yeah, you can go ahead and install it yourself. We just need to know where to deliver the pots. What bay are you currently at? Uh, so one of the one of the lower numbers. <laughs> Forget. Um, she looks at you for a solid two seconds as like, like the silence just kind of drops. And she goes, uh-huh. Oh, excuse me, Mr. Zug. And she kind of like motions you over here. Uh, uh-huh. And then she <laughs> looks past you to the guard and says, uh, yeah, excuse me. Um, can we go ahead and get that uh, show model over the back there? The one that you said you were gonna get a few hours ago? I actually do need it now. Um, all right, sure thing. And you'll watch as he just sort of unlocks. All right, that should buy him a couple of minutes. So, where's your ship actually? Insight check. <laughs> it's right there, and I tell her exactly where it is. <laughs> she nods and says, "Ah, figure." Good for him. All right. Uh, we yeah, can go. We're we smuggling. Can... And she holds up her hand. She's like, <laughs> I, "I don't need to know. I don't need to know. We don't have too much time." But there is going to be a little bit of a surcharge for that. So the one-time deal, uh, we're going to toss that out the window. I'm so sorry. Uh, and now the price is one up to 120 credits. But we will deliver it wherever you wit. No questions asked. Deal? All right. Well, let's talk about some firepower, all right? You know, okay. what, uh, what kind of damage this thing can do? That's a pretty decent. A, a Say pretty you need to get into amount. an abandoned space station that's completely sealed off by the Ionian government. 
Would this punch a hole in there? All right, I don't want to know, but it depends on what kind of space station. If it's abandoned, it's probably old tech, which means this could probably blast in pretty easily. However, I'm pretty sure the entire place is going to be covered in some sort of buoy system that the government's going to identify immediately and then be on your ass. Hypothetically, of course, she says, yeah. looking at you dead-eyed. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, just like, the fuck are you doing right now? <laughs> so he's just smiling. He's just having a conversation. <laughs> okay, okay. So would this take out one of the buoys then? Well, yes, probably. But usually there's a wider security net. Mm. If this is what I think it is. It's probably not. He looks over and says, But if it is, I think a certain desperado may have an answer for you. Uh, okay. <laughs> Hypothetically speaking. Theoretically, of course. Of course. Mm. Uh, and then you'll see the door open as the guard just... I'll take it. Wise choice, sir. And if you could just uh, type the bay number here and type it for your security, of course. And she looks at you just dead. Like, it's like, please don't say it out loud. <laughs> I, you I, dumb, dumb man. <laughs> at, me as me doesn't remember the bay, but I will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I will type the, the bay number. Yeah, so you type in the number. She looks, she nods, and she says, I can have it to you in 48 hours and then closes the sale. All right, so that'll be your down to 537 credits. Okay, and hmm, I mean, I guess this is a party question, so I'll, I will uh, take my little receipt and then head on out of here. Mm -hmm. I wink at the guard, but he doesn't see because I'm wearing my goggles. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he winks back, you don't see because he's wearing his helmet. <laughs> Hey guys. Hey. Oh, oh hey. 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 I bought a missile. Oh, awesome. Are we about <laughs> ready to roll out then? Uh, well, were we doing this now? Or were we staying for a bit? I mean, can we stay for a moment? What, what else do we, like, we're not even really supposed to be here. What else do we gotta do? You know, wait for my missile. Ah. Wait for my hedgehog. Oh. Hedgehog? <laughs> I need to find a hobby for like three days. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I guess I guess I could kill some time. What I mean, the I just hell are you my doing? Job. <laughs> what, what? <laughs> could, they'd probably give me a pack if I went back in there. <laughs> Yo, you got a job, buddy? What are you doing? Uh, yes. Cool. What was that? <laughs> Mom said, <laughs> says to suck. What? Why are you in that? What are you doing? Um, pulls the pulls the, the hat off and like sloshes half out. Well, he got this guy whoever was in this thing, uh, got chased out of the store by rats. Remember? So Drask and I went to go look for them, only to find they had been completely devoured. Yeah, he got eaten the all the rats, way, down to the bone and blood. Nothing in the suit at all. So I take it and I say, well. I'm gonna go back in there and get his last paycheck. So I did. Dark. Oh, kind of dark, kind of smart, but also I don't think rats could eat a person without there being blood. Well, maybe these are special space rats. If there was enough, they could. Also, we did see rats the size of us just a couple weeks ago. But there was blood. Yeah, but what if they were all very small and a lot more space oriented? I, I don't, clear? I don't think that's what that is. Well, I don't think that's what it is. Whatever you think. Yeah, well, that's what you think. That's not right. That's wrong. 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 Bomb puts the helmet, the hat back on. Wrong. I turn away. I turn away. Wrong. <laughs> oh no. 
a silence so falls over the station. So we're spending another three days here or something or what? <laughs> Wait, do we, have a, do we have a missile shooter? How do we shoot oh. the missile you're buying? It should yeah. just attach. And I, I asked about that. We don't need a launcher. We just need a missile and, you know. I can throw it. <laughs> How long is it to this station anyway? Uh, Brent. Let's find out. So, would you go back to your ship to activate its uh, navigation? I mean, I assume that we're just gonna like spend the night in our ship instead of buying a room. Right. Ew. Yeah. That's something that port dwellers would do. So, uh, so. Bu -bu 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 see if I can find the. Yep, there we are. I'll activate this. <laughs> So we're hopping around time a little bit because, you know, assuming you guys get, eventually get back to your ship, this is something that you would track or find out over time. Uh, so you, let's see here. It will take you, okay, so you are over. Oh, yeah, you're over here, which means that crosses there. Oh yeah, 24 hours. It's a uh, oh. it's a little bit farther than Io, slightly. So it would take one day to get there. That's not bad. I mean, like the thing is, the way I see it above board is that, um, considering like getting a miss, like we're, it's a it's a stealth mission to get on. We don't want to get seen or caught. So having a missile on board, like I'm not sure how much benefit that's going to have to us because we don't it's want a, to do a it's firefight a backup. with the... We don't want anything with I mean, them, if we get into a firefight with the Navy, we're not winning. <laughs> I've seen our missile. ship. Yes, but it's not for a firefight. It's for breaching a hole in this sealed off station that no one can get into or it's for taking out like a, a just, you know, beacon or buoy or whatever there, to, you know, whatever. Listen, we can time skip. Brett, it's two days later. We're going. <laughs> Ah, oh, Karumba. Uh, hold on. I need a funny uh, <laughs> agreement on that. I mean, I appreciate out. you firing from the hip that there, was, That was the boldest thing I've ever yeah, seen. Yeah, I went a year, actually. Yeah, Can I, we go forward a year right now? <laughs> it's four years later. I'm almost dead, all right? I'm in the middle of a crater <laughs> on a foreign planet. Brett, take it from there. <laughs> Doug's dead. Oh. Oh, good life. I climbed the management chain of Clint. <laughs> I forgot to get on the ship two days later. Tomato has one thing on his mind, and that's to be the head of Clerk. <laughs> I gotta get rid of this outfit. Do you, though? Kinda. <laughs> Put it in storage. It's a good disguise. I think we should keep it. You really think so? Yeah. They didn't know you, it was you. Well, that's because I went up to them in a store that that guy worked at in the mascot outfit of the store. Look, if I went into any of those stores, they'd probably think it's pretty weird I'm wearing this. But they wouldn't think you're a slime man. True, actually. That is true. Wait a minute. That could... <laughs> Tomato, you want to play your old character now? <laughs> this is like this is like some dystopian <laughs> shit almost to me. That like I'm back to playing Clarent in different <laughs> characters' voice. <laughs> That's fucking funny. Okay. Maybe I can well, use it as a disguise for Mito. Yeah. Ooh. Uh, I personally think we're good to just fast forward, grab our missile, and then go on the mission. Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, let's go. Well, if that's the case, then I am going to do two days of rolling Mito. <laughs> two days of work in that outfit in the store. You get your and job I'll back. Go, oh, I could get my job back. <laughs> no, that's a quick two wild. days later. <laughs> <laughs> Mm -hmm. So I will let you know that yes, you can uh, get your job back if you want. <laughs> no one is chomping at the bit for this position. Uh, you will be paid at a rate of one moment, please. So this is how we know how sad it was. How much money I got from this? Guy. <laughs> You're, you'll get uh, after the end. You will be paid um, seven credits. Holy! Ooh, wow, we. <laughs> hey, can we what? all work here for two days? But, but. Uh, if you do take the job, uh, we will have to play the Clarent Mart theme while you're rolling Mido, buddy. Also, Ooh. there's, like, I know the bit was that you rolled super low on your intelligence check, but there is still a guy that that oh, job yeah, belongs yeah. to. Well, I don't have to worry about that because the bomb thinks this guy's dead and therefore he doesn't need the money. Oh, yeah. 
So he's yeah. not gonna feel bad. And if this guy does show up, well, well, we kill him. Well, I'll have to kill him. <laughs> yeah. We hide his body for real this time. I don't think the bomb is gonna go back into. Town. I don't think he's. <laughs> yeah. I don't think he's that dumb. But he will keep the suit. All right, and I will give you. <laughs> nice. A Clert Mart's uh, Clert Mart uh, mascot outfit. Just There's something like kind of like horror movie esque about owning like this rat devoured, mm -hmm. like scratched up nasty suit of this. Hey, can I try to patch it up, make it look Frankenstein esque from just yeah, shoddy dude. patching? Let's fucking go to town. Alright, one, one quick second. I definitely think there's like a couple more like uh Yep things I would like to do during this quick time skip thing we're sure doing. Thing. But yeah. we don't have to like RP it out. I would like to spend a little bit of money buying some more uh, supplies for crafting, like uh, drinks. Okay. Uh, so uh, you would go ahead and buy that over at the tavern. And we're looking at here. So, cause you have been collecting a bunch of mixing brew. You currently have 402 gold pieces of, um, of liquor you've acquired from the bar that was there before. Uh, so how much uh, alcohol are you looking to purchase? Uh, can I um, get the total I have up to 600? Uh, yes, you can. Let me just go ahead and do a little quick math. All right, your credit is 361 credits and you have 600 credits of uh, mixing brew. Damn. Good shit. Hey, I can't suggest this in game because I don't think the bomb understands space enough, but I will say this above board and maybe one of your characters can connect the dots on this. Do you guys think there's gonna be any oxygen or anything to breathe on that station? You can Definitely not, not if we blow it open. You can uh, buy spacesuits. There is, oh yeah, we need spacesuits. I would have space remembered that at least. Suit. These spacesuits are also modular, it's been a minute. so you guys would actually have to. You would uh, guys would actually be able to uh, customize your spacesuit with what you. Ooh. Want. Yo. I need horn ports in mine. <laughs> Let me see here. Okay. So if you wish to buy a spacesuit, uh, at base they are two hundred credits a suit. Um, by default, though, they double your suffocation rate, which means however long you can hold your breath you can hold double in a spacesuit. Um, nice. For 100 credits, you can uh, purchase a ship attachment for your spacesuit, which means that while you are plugged into the ship, uh, you do not rely on the spacesuit's oxygen. You get the, if, as long as the ship has oxygen, you have oxygen. Uh, cool. So you don't have to worry yeah. about oxygen running out or whatever. While uh, we're looking at purchasing these, can the bomb see if he can get one that's like, extremely discounted and is missing like oxygen things like is essentially just a thermal suit like a like just as a like a, um a, so you're just looking one that's for... going to protect me from the cold of space but i it was established uh at uh, least yeah you RP, don't need the oxygen that i don't that need to correct. breathe so if i can get a discount on something by like basically at, like being like i just need this to repair my suit mm -hmm. can like i get like a can i cut patches. that like down a little bit uh so i'm gonna go ahead and do a fate roll for that Unfortunately, no. Uh, these all are come from wholesale, so they can't take apart the spacesuit. They can only add or attach things to it, so you will have to pay the full price. Dude, the real Clarence never would have rolled that low. <laughs> <laughs> wow. All right, who's going to be my sugar baby? I will have 161 credits left when I buy this. I have zero. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And last I checked, wait a minute, Felsic, you still mm -hmm. got a little bit of distance to travel before you're poor like the rest of us. Ex yeah, that's what I'm, yes, that's what I'm saying. I that's do have distance up. to travel. Uh, uh, you know, I'm just thinking about redistributing some of the wealth um, to my less, my less fortunate uh, sugar bait companions. Help me, help <laughs> me, sugar pay for companions. my suit, help me. No, you, no, you said oh. you would have like 170 credits oh. left over. Help me. You gotta stop looking at me with those eyes. Help. No. I can't go back to minimum wage. <laughs> 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 
Well, okay, um, Brett, I'm gonna buy myself a suit of, in a, <laughs> a port. I want to buy myself a suit in a ship port. Three okay. other credit. All right, so, uh, so you're doing that and the ship port. Oh, that's a very luxurious item you got there. Very oh, nice. absolutely. Uh, I can nice. afford it. Yes, you can. Uh, so, uh, what I was about to finish saying is, with the ship attachment, you can go as far as 600 feet uh, outside Damn. of the ship as long as you are plugged Ooh. into the ship. Uh, All right, cool. And it does not take up the suit's oxygen. Um, every oh. hundred credits will increase it by a hundred feet. And you could also expand your oxygen tank, uh, your your oxygen tank, uh, by a hundred, um, by another multiplier for every hundred credits you spend. Okay, cool. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna do the startup of just the suit in the. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I, I just want mm -hmm. this is just, this is just more for everyone to know. Okay, understood. Okay, so spacesuit, spacesuit with shipboard. Brett, is mm -hmm. it reasonable to say, looking at the space suit, since it's not made for, like, the bomb's physiology, that he would be able to fit, like, Mito in one of the arms or something? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, you could you, like, you, you can, you can fit a Mito, as long okay. as they're not, like, an ape Mito. Um, well, you can, but he'd be, like, just in the suit himself, and it'd look really weird. Uh, but, yes, you can fit yourself and Mito in the same suit. Okay. I will buy a suit for whoever here is too fucking broke because uh, I still have like fifteen hundred credits. But I might not buy you a plug. Might just be a suit. But, uh, yeah, I'm not. I'm not getting a tiny one. Plug. You know, the size of a hedgehog. <laughs> <laughs> you want a you want a little one the size of a hedgehog? <laughs> yeah, and I'll throw him out there and I'll watch him from the ship. No, we can't get a hedgehog, guys. Well, just, just get, just get a like a Tupperware container and put it in there, <laughs> huh? like, a, like a heat pack or something. <laughs> no, chill. <laughs> make a hedgehog. Those things got a good seal. Uh, no, is no, nobody, nobody's biting. I have nobody? no money. Hey, does he's pockets no a moth flies out? Ask me. Ask. I nicely. would like a spacesuit, please. Okay, I buy Drask a spacesuit. Wahoo! You get yourself a normal spacesuit. Mm -hmm. Whoa! You, go, you are now uh, one thousand two hundred fourteen credits. Mm hmm. Is this thing flammable? Don't set it on fire. Oh. That's expensive. All right. Got it. Okay. Uh, so the next thing, so three spacesuits have been purchased. Uh, next thing you want to do is do, uh, Mido rolls, is that correct? Yeah. So, what, two days straight of just awful uh, Mido just, rolls? Just disgusting uh, Mido rolls, cool. yeah. Or, we'll just do eight D, well, yep. we'll do, we'll do two separate, uh, D100s, because when we leave the station, it'll be the second. So. Okay. Sounds good. So we'll uh, first start with the first one. Yeah, don't roll the next one yet. Um, yep. So, uh, you will gain the following. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, you would gain uh, lightning. Mitos' uh, buddy's radiation blast has the option to deal lightning. You will get uh, radiated vampirism. At the oh end of Mitosis Buddy's round, all creatures within 15 feet of Mitosis Buddy must succeed a constitution saving throw equal to your spellcasting DC or be dealt 1d10 radiation damage. Mitosis Buddy heals for the sum of radiation <laughs> damage dealt. All creatures Damn. in range gain one hidden radiation stack. That's fucked up. <laughs> Just starts. I learned. You hear Model's head pop up oh. at the end. Just looking over at you. Not this again. Yep. Uh, and then finally, acid. Mitosis Buddy's radiation blast has the option to deal acid damage. Okay. Oh. A fascinating Mito Buddy. You just uh, farming mutations, mate? Yeah, I just can't help myself from gaming the system whenever I have the chance. <sighs> Can I just look at the stars? Yeah, sure. And that Mito Buddy will just stare at the stars. For the oh. rest of their existence. Oh, I hate that. <laughs> that is fucking dark. Uh, <laughs> Maybe we're doing a bad thing. Let's go again. Woohoo! Yippee! We go again. Oh god, we are we are we are going again. Holy shit. Okay, so that's some good shit already. So let me go ahead and and uh just real quick. Okay, there we go. Uh, so we'll start with the 87. Uh, fly. Mitosis Buddy gains a fly speed Ooh. of 30 feet. Ooh. 
And then finally, the 100, I believe, is you roll twice and take both results, correct? Uh, yes. All Ooh, right. Uh, I so, don't think these will count as things that I've technically rolled for discovery, so these are just kind of for fun. Correct. So roll 2d100, and those will also be added in addition to this Mido. 2d100. All right. Uh, we'll go down to 29. Uh, 29 will be a teleport. Mitosis Buddy's movement is replaced by a teleport up to its movement. And then finally, uh, oh, not done yet. Slow resilience. Mitosis Buddy has disadvantage on all saving throws, and all attacks against Mitosis Buddy are made at advantage. However, Mitosis Buddy gains resistance to all damage sources. Interesting, interesting. Whoa. Uh, 13 is going to be Confusion. Mitosis Buddy is always under the mm-hmm. effect of the Confusion spell. And then finally... This poor one ain't it. <laughs> yep. And then finally, <laughs> I need everyone to roll a Wisdom saving throw, please, as the Mitosis Buddy's frightful presence goes off. Damn, that one hits a lot. Oh! Oof. Ooh. 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 No sweat, no sweat. Uh, Zug... Wisdom saving throw, please. Are you afraid? Yes. Uh, Drask and Zug are both frightened of the uh, mitosis, buddy. I like to imagine they're frightened. It's weird. By like the general confusion. Yep. It starts drooling and looking all over the place. Uh, Slailing around. um, But uh, after a minute, you will be immune to that effect. So you're good to go there. All right, and then I will finally drag all these out. Big ol' honkin' boy. All right, so we've got, uh, as a recap, fly. Uh, we have confusion. 67. Frightful presence. Oh, we actually, we actually mixed something up. Teleport. 100 is you make an effect, Brett. Like, uh, you uh, just make uh, one up. One is we roll two. Oh. 100 is you choose something that this guy just has. Make anything up. Make uh, it wacky. The station blows up. All right, so uh, apologies for that. So good news is uh, no frightful presence, no confusion. Uh, I will. I'm, I have to think. And then the you got some time. I mean, you could even resilience. fucking throw it out there if it comes up in the next. Oh no no no! I'm I'm okay. I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna keep it in the back of my mind. But there is an unknown mutation. Very cool. And that is the Mito Buddy. Uh, so with that, <clears throat> after a couple of days uh, of long rest, there's the Mito Buddy over there. We're going um, medium or small with this one, by the way. It's always small. Always small. <laughs> so... Uh, after a couple of days, you're, you're going to actually see a couple of the station guards come down to where your ship is. Um, you will see as they're walking over, they seem to be walking with a sense of um, kind of annoyed purpose as they are dragging in this large crate and drop it by your ship and then leave. Oh, yay. <laughs> My <Nasty>. delivery. <laughs> So, upon it, you will see it is uh, it is definitely a worn down missile uh, launcher. Um, you see how it's purpose that it will um, require recharging essentially whenever you reach the station as part of part of that. But it doesn't actually launch like physical missiles. It creates like these forms of force missiles that blast out. Um, but uh, those they burn out very quickly. So you have to get it recharged over at stations. So you would drag the missile launcher in and kind of like pull it uh, into your cargo bay. And you'll see it like almost takes up the whole the whole cargo, just the various parts and the things that are there. Um, the question is, if you wish to use this missile launcher, you're going to have to give something up because the ticket is at max capacity. Toilet? That's, that would not, <laughs> that's not what I bet. <laughs> oh. So mm. you uh, can choose to disable one of the following uh, if you would like to use the missiles for this trip. You can, you, you can dis- 
Yeah, you can disable your ship blaster, your shield system, the FTL drive, which is not an option, the energy fuel storage, which is not an option. Yeah, the I oxygen think, supply is not an option. To be honest, we're yeah. just going to put it in storage. Okay. <laughs> we might just have to put it in the cargo bay. Okay. But you will have your missile launcher there and ready to go. Foggers. Okay, let's do this job so we get more money so I can get more uh, uh, expansion slot for the ship. Yeah, let's get was, out of here. How long would the job take, do you think? Uh, DM. I mean, oh, it's a... I couldn't tell you. Okay. <laughs> Does uh, Bo have a calendar? Do we have any sense of time? Got, oh, you have take... a sense of time, but I can't tell you how long something's going to take It's going to take a take day to get there. We do the I mean, job. Like a, and I want Bo to have, like, a calendar or like Mark's Mark's little like uh like divots in the side oh, of the ship. Oh gotcha, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sad old bow. One day. All right. So the flight will be uh go off without a hitch. I'm just gonna move this down here because this technically counts as a token. Uh you will oh that actually works perfectly. Awesome. Uh, you will leave the Omnos trade station and then start heading over to the restricted station. Uh, it does take you 24 hours to get there and there is no incident along the way. However, uh, you would be you would also have been given information of what is happening on the station and exactly how to board. Desperado would give you um, the knowledge that the ship itself uh, they believe can be entered uh, from a tram that can be easily hacked uh, in a small sort of like miniature little spaceport um, where they, where I guess there was some travel that was done to and from the station. So the tram goes to and from the station. Um, the problem and the reason why people can't board the station besides it activating the buoys uh, is that it's completely, you can see it now as you approach the station. It is completely covered around by these space mines that are just hovering there. These sort of <laughs> almost like D4s, like shaped objects is the best way I could describe it. It's just surrounding the station. Uh, Desperado informs you uh, that if the information is correct, the tram uh, will not set off the mines because it's recognized as part of the ship. This is kind of the loophole that they figured out. Uh, however, some things to keep in mind. Two parties have already tried to come here and did not return, uh, and there was no message of them going out and spending any money or, or exchanging fuel, uh, so it is safe to assume that they are either didn't make it in transit or are still here. So, and as you do approach, uh, you will see uh, the two ships boarded at the small station where they took the tram would see that the tram is still functional which means the mines did not go off but it's safe to assume that the crew uh, is either just been camping out in their ship or they are still on the station yeah yeah they're probably just camping out <laughs> <laughs> yeah really yeah, really cool nothing. awesome awesome that's epic <laughs> So you begin your approach. What do you do? I gotta, I gotta make my actual Mito for this thing. The final two rolls. Uh, I'm gonna lock in the traits on Mito of, uh, hang on, the exact numbers, uh, 76 and 96. Uh, good choice. Oh, yeah. did you already roll your, your third I'm gonna Mito roll a 2D uh, 100 right now. Ah, uh, gotcha. Okay, but we do it in that order, so I don't like cheese the hell out of it. All right. So, uh, what were the? Oh, the I numbers? just got seventy six. So it's it. just it'll be it'll be Whoa. three then. So well, I well since I rolled it, oh, it'll only be three traits. Yes. Yeah, I guess I guess that makes sense. Uh, so, uh, seventy six. Uh, what was the one that you wanted to hold on to? Uh, so I want, um, ninety six. Ninety six as well. Okay. <laughs> uh, and then you also got 91. Oh, fun. Rebirth. When Mitosis Buddy first drops to zero hit points, it's restored back to one health. It can only do this during once of one of its lifespans. Oh, my God. Ew. Nasty. 
<laughs> All right. Go like that. It should stay dead. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's kind of fucked. We dock up. It's up to you. Oh, I'm gonna make sure to long rest. If you haven't long rested, I was missing HP and stuff. Oh, oh um, yeah, yeah. Check. Make sure you guys have activated your long rest. Oh, so true, so true. There's that button. There's that button. Yeah, I don't remember how to press it either. <laughs> Click. Uh. Uh. I can help you in a moment. I just need to get your crew over to this map. Give me one second. Oh, Grask, Felsic, a bomb, mm -hmm. Zug, and Mido Buddy. As you guys will uh, hop aboard the train, making sure. We're... I'm gonna take my spacesuit with me in case there are any areas that are like uh, sealed of off course. from oxygen. And by mm -hmm. and by default, all of you have spa your space your uh, space suits in your inventory. Just FYI. Yeah. Okay, cool. Unless you specify otherwise. Wait, I did I forget to say that I bought one? Uh, yes, you did. <laughs> yeah, you straight up did, dude. <laughs> you were gone for like yeah, you a good for ten minutes. Days on the station, never bought a suit. No one. I thought asked. I thought I just like casually would have also, but that's fine. I don't need one. <laughs> okay, it's like <laughs> I don't need one. Flex, flex. All right, give me one. What am I gonna do? Die? There's the think... long rest. Okay. I think after the uh, tragedy that was the last uh, spacefaring Mido freezing to death and dying outside the ship, Mom would just be casually already wearing his suit with Mido in the arms. Since oh, buddy. He doesn't need to breathe. He's just going to be in the sealed up suit. <laughs> I'm assuming that if he goes outside, he's just going to start dying. Yeah, that might stop some of the just passive radiation stuff from emitting from you, yeah? After some time, uh, you will feel as the tram will uh, go into, because at, at one point you're just listening to nothing in the tram. The lights themselves will kind of flicker on and off as the as you're kind of just floating within space. And then you'll just sort of hear this, this connecting sound as the, your, your cart is now, has hit something, but is still moving. Safe to assume it's going down a tunnel until uh, after about, I'd say, five minutes, you'll feel the impact of, a, of the tram just just hit against the, the pulley brakes. Then you'll hear, boom, as this door will unlock for those that wish to approach and walk through. Okay, all right, I'll go first. All right, so as you approach, uh, you- Take a peek. Yeah. <laughs> Get out. There we go. There go. Uh, if you need help moving out, just let me know. I'll be happy to get you out there. Uh, it all looks clear so far. Uh, as you walk in, you'll kind of see uh, all of these these little rollies over here. What appears to be an old tram station is what you would imagine mm. completely rusted over. Uh, any signs of the other parties? Like, I don't know, candy wrappers or something? <laughs> You're free to roll an investigation check. All right. I'm super good at investigating. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you detect no presence of another crew. It's empty. Sure yeah. is. <laughs> it's like incomprehensibly empty. Um, I can As you cross... As you cross over through the bars, you'll see them kind of like you jump over, felt like you begin to push it, and then you'll see it spin a little bit. And as it does, you'll kind of hear as the lights just suddenly. It's turn always on. me. It's always me. I always do. Now this. hang I'm on, sorry. the lights just turned on. Relax, I, relax. <sighs> and you just <sighs> and, and you hear the station kind of do a general hum, as if something has turned on inside. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Uh, does old world tech have like motion activation? 
<laughs> Probably. That seems fine. <laughs> yeah, this seems fine. Something's off. What? What? There might be rats. On this ship, devoured everyone already. Mm. Down to the blood and bone. <laughs> Down to the blood and bone. You know, a little bird told me that space rats are worth like 500 credits a pop. Yeah. Wait, really? I think we should grab them. When we keep, keep them alive. Them. Yep, keep them in cages on the ship. Breed them. So. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna try this door and take a peek. You just kind of look through a metal hallway. There's some, uh, like, ro there's like some robotic sentries down here. Do they, are they moving at all? No, they're oh, yeah. deactivated. It reminds oh. me. Right, I'm going to put down my protector dog. I put down the protector. You, you, I, I mean, I could, I could, do we, if we think they're going to wake up, I could shoot them from here. I would, <clears throat> Yeah, it's a good good idea. Oh, that's not it. Is it a Wrong. good idea? <laughs> Maybe just give one like a blast to see if it reacts. Well, that's why I was asking all of you before I did it. No, no, no. I think you should they're do gonna it. wake up at some point. Yeah, we should it, just shoot them now. <laughs> we can I'm surprise them. The, I'm the other waiting way. for Zug before right, I do me, anything. Zug. Do you think I should shoot them? Right, they're gonna wake up, Zug. Right. Yeah, 100%. they probably gonna wake oh, way up. Way down there? Yeah. Way down there. Wait, maybe we get closer first, and then you blast them. Yeah, maybe we get, uh, you know, we chop their heads off. Maybe you look at, what if they have, like, no power? Maybe you check it out first, yeah. I, yeah I'll, you I'll know what, we'll, we'll, we voting? Because I say shoot it now. Uh. Well, I'll go in front in front. And we just inch. Let me go touch it. Okay, you go touch. We stay here, then. Hey, wake up! Wake up, wake up, wake up! He just says over and over as they approach. <laughs> wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up! We're gonna rob this place! If you don't wake up! No, we're fine. Alright. Yeah, just a, just a husk. Could I, uh, could I check this thing out? No, I'm backing up. I'm not doing this. Go uh, ahead, no. Go ahead and make a... You can do an investigation check or do an engineer's tools check. You know I gotta do that investigation. Whoa. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh. And as you start to, like, approach it to look over, you'll watch as the eye just shoots on, and then this ancient tech will look down at you. And it'll, it'll just state... It'll resonate within its core. It'll resonate. <clears throat> A story detected. And it'll go on the offensive. Haha, -ha, you didn't trick us! I know. <laughs> he got still him. tricked us! We were gonna blast him from back there! We got we could've, we could've I been, don't know why. I, can't I need everyone. <laughs> we could've put something on the ground. We could've, he could've walked in it. We could've set up. It's cool, it's cool. You bozos. Initiative. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna roll guys, initiative for you guys. It's gonna turn on. <laughs> it's gonna turn on. Let's shoot Just it from back there. <laughs> Get some distance and fire while it's not ready. Hey, I'm right behind you. Hey, bud. Yeah, I came up here. Just to be clear, if you thought I was going to fire from <laughs> far away. Plurt? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so... What was that? <laughs> <laughs> did you just... <laughs> did you just say plurt? <laughs> For a second, I was like, where What? Where am I? What time is it? <laughs> did I imagine pipe dreamers? Yeah. <laughs> Clint, it's up. your turn, Clint. <laughs> Clint wake, wake up, up. dude. <laughs> you fell off the circus caravan. <laughs> wake up. We're about to start episode 56 of Goblins. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah, that's... Uh, we're going to laugh about this. The Bomb and Drask. What the Currently, fuck does that mean? Just you two. The bomb and Mito are technically in the same thing because Mito is in the suit. Right. So the bomb is going to move. No. Well, okay. So you're not, you're, it's not your turn oh, yet. I, this is more of just me letting you know something. Oh, okay. So the bomb oh. and Drask. 
you both hmm god damn it you both suddenly get a sense of deja vu as if this was something you had done before and now to continue a session that we did over a year ago the auto is turned hallway. on well, what? <laughs> A bomb, it's oh, your oh, turn. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh no. Huh? Oh no. That's not good. Huh? Well, a, uh. A bomb, it's your turn. Yeah, the bomb's gonna move back 30 feet. I'm moving Mido with me just because we're technically same block right now. Uh, he's gonna try to. He's just gonna blast this guy with Eldritch Blast to get him away from. Uh, Zug. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna do that. Uh, we're gonna sh we're gonna do. Hold on, I'm sorry, I'm having trouble just grabbing the bomb here. Uh, radiation blast one out towards the guy. That's a 14 to hit. Uh, it doesn't. You'll watch as these these uh, of a tech that you do not recognize yet feels awfully familiar as these energy shields will. Deflect up, just absorbing the radiation blast. Okay. But your magic also, seems slightly foreign, and you'll actually watch as the shield will kind of fizzle back a little bit, but no, it does not make contact. Also, since um, it slip, it always slips my mind when yes. we start uh, situations where we're on a map, uh, can we do the inspiration for these three? Yep. Felsic already has it. Yep, that but, works for uh, me. I don't think she would otherwise. So the three in the front line. Okay. Uh, second beam is a 20 to hit for 12. Uh, that will strike, dealing 12 points of damage. Okay. And I'd like to push them back. You'll watch as this, this ancient tech sort of just backs up a little bit, um, and it stumbles, almost like, a, like, a, like an infant, like stumbling back. And then it levels itself up and looks forward and looks like it's about to move towards you. And then I'm going to use my bonus action to have Mido flop out of the suit on the ground. A little larger than I remember, but that's okay. I'm going to have them... I'm not, I'm not going to have them move. I'm just going to have them flop down since they technically moved with me. Mm -hmm. uh, but I'm going to have them radiation blast the guy. Okay, let's uh, see. It. Ten, so that's nothing. Yeah, that'll but, miss. Hey, he was, he's disoriented from being inside the suit. Doesn't know where he is. His <laughs> eyes are dilated. Uh, if that's the end of your turn, make sure yeah, to sorry. hit. Yeah, and nope, you're good. Zug. <laughs> My God, he turned on. Uh, I'm just gonna wait. Wait a minute. Hmm. Ah, oh, God, maybe that's worth. I'm gonna run up and. Uh... Oh, you're gonna run up after I got him away from you. Damn right. Right on. I didn't ask for your fucking help. I remember Pulls that. out dust of corrosion. Sprinkles Whoa. a little, a little salt bay dust on this guy. All right. Uh, is there... It's been a minute for me, but you'll sprinkle the dust. Just checking to see there is a constitution save. So this will be made okay. at a disadvantage because of the uh, how this thing is formed. And the Ooh. dust will... Boom, baby! We'll sprinkle over, and I believe that is going to be a 48. Yep, 48 points Whoa. of damage, please. Roll a 48. And you'll just Boom. watch as oh. it just immediately, quickly, just sort of rusts away as a hole begins to form within its chest. And as it looks at that, you'll slowly see um, that the hole is sort of de-rusting as if the construct is trying to reassemble itself. Oh. Interesting. Oh. No time to think about that now, though. Doggy, to me! <laughs> Ow, wow. Eh. To me? To me? And Doggy <laughs> not move? Oh, there it goes. Okay. Woo. Uh, moves there, and will activate, giving uh, myself, Drask, and Felsic a shoe. 
Do, do. Why, thank you. Mm, uh, you're most welcome. Protector. Activate. Excellent. I will be applying Whoa. temporary hit points. Boop, 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 boop. Temporary hit points have been activated. I'm going to slowly start turning everyone's hit points. Zug, is there anything else? That was the end of that round, so please hit um, end round. Unless I want to be a little silly, take a little huh? attack of opportunity from this guy. Well, just so you know. I don't he... enter. Okay. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> the turret does go at the end of your turn, so you can't do that. However, oh. that did sound pretty fun. So we're <laughs> going to start with the, with, with the, 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 the construct like lurching down uh, upon, we'll kind of <laughs> look down, and as one of its hands is like covering over the deep wound you've given to this thing, as it raises up its hand, you'll see this like blue radiated axe just, <laughs> just form as this energy crackles down upon you twice. And I don't think it hits. E oh, and one of them hits, unless you one do hits. something about it. Uh... Ah. All right. Neuron axe. God, what a sigma! Yeah, you're gonna watch as just it just chops down the temporary barrier. So you'll see that this axe of pure energy will just slash down upon the the, the barrier that your turret came up, and then you manage to dodge the second one, and then it and then it holds the axe up and ready to go for a second round. But Bo, it's your turn. Okay, Bo looks a little bit frustrated, and he's like, "Yeah, I told you so." And he takes a few steps <laughs> forward, and as he's kind of as he's running forward a bit, he just yells, "Moon beam!" Oh, he oh hell yeah! Moon beam. <laughs> yeah, you're just gonna watch as the shields upon this creature tries to get back up, and then the moon beam just pssst, as this orbitable bombardment of energy just blasts down. And it takes the full amount as 10 points of damage mm. goes. You'll just see as these sparks are just forming around this construct. Um, it seems to be trying to get an energy barrier of its own, but can't with the constant uh, the constant hit of the of the beam. <laughs> Take that. Elsa. Mm. I'm going to move up to it. Hmm. I feel like it's. Eh, I don't really want to expend stuff super early. Uh, I'm gonna just. I'm gonna give it a regular swing and see how it responds to it. Cause I I don't know if it has any kind of resistances. Not uh, for fourteen. Uh, or fourteen damage. <laughs> I'm assuming a twenty hits. Ah, Unless it doesn't. Ballsy. Uh, yes, it does hit. Fourteen points of damage. Your axe does full amounts of it. As the, radi mm. as the radiant energy is blasting from the sky and you're jumping as well, it can't maintain its defenses. Ah, hog. Okay, I, I'm gonna end my turn for now. Okay. Grass. Okay, uh, I turn into giant ape. No, I don't, I can't do that. Why would I think <laughs> what? I could? Hmm. What? <laughs> what? Beautiful, I love that. Weird. That was That was wonderful. Um. Yeah, I go in, uh, I expend my resources early on, and I rage. <laughs> yeah! Why not? You... Brother! Don't worry, uh, I'll carry his out of here. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so I rage real quick, and uh, I try to stab. All right, let's see that stabby stab. Nope, I don't... Ah! Miss. Huh. Listen, I'm, I'm not in the right headspace. Something's weird. Oh, it's just that one? Okay. Yeah, I yeah. bonus action to rage, so. <clears throat> and you'll just watch as this this robot goes in and with just an absolute unhinged flurry of attacks with its blade arm, it just kind of goes into this like, grind, this absolute like grinder circle attack on you. Um, so the first one will be an 11, which will miss. And then on that disadvantage is a 12, which will also miss as you're just watching this thing spiral out of control against you. <clears throat> the bomb. The bomb is going to cast 
uh, Conjure Radimental. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, right here. All right. So Wait, you can just make up moves now? Yeah. Bada <laughs> bing. I wrote that. Check <laughs> it out. I made this. Smile. I made this. All Brett right. made it, but I clicked it. Which means it's, it's yours now. It's mine now. Uh, all right. So give me one second. I have to drag out a token. I thought I had a rudimental already, but apparently I did not. But that's okay. That's okay because my bonus action was to do uh, an attack on this guy first, so I can just do that while you uh, grab the character icon. Yeah, yeah, I got it. So I'm going to do two beams at the small guy. Okay. First is a 23, and the second is a 19. Both will uh, at the small guy? Yeah, both will hit. Cool. Because I want to push that guy uh, over to here. And then okay. put the radimental here at the maximum distance. And oh, just had that thing just spell. hover over there, yeah. Yeah. Oh, so I want to put it at the corner here and have this guy here. Okay. So I'm gonna just drag this out for now because that works. And Whoa. You'll just see as this thing as you push over here, correct? Yeah. Yeah. And you can okay. also, if, if you want, you can just make this sad slime because I don't have sad slime's old spell anymore. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Oh, this, this, uh, I can, I can do, uh, I'll, I'll make a rudimental, uh, for you and we can do sad slime version. Okay. Because I have, I oh. have conjure, I, I do have summon aberration, but I don't have the old, uh, sad slime spell anymore. I switched it out for summon aberration. So it'd be a okay. shame if we didn't get to use sad slime. No, real oh, sad. no, no. It's, it's, it's all, it, it's real sad. No, it's, it's all good. We're good. Okay. Okay. So yeah, this rudimental will come out and just, just yeah. hover over there. And that Radimental's gonna take two slam attacks on this guy. <coughs> All right, <coughs> here we go. Just double checking the thing right here. Slam is 1d10 plus four plus the spell. Oh yes, there it is. Spell attack, okay. Uh, what's your spell attack modifier again? Uh, oh boy. Um, should be good, right? My, yeah, you're, are you plus six or plus seven on your spell attack bonus? Uh, it's plus... I mean, it's, it's hard. It's hard for me to see it on. Uh, no, it's okay. I, I can do the math. Should be for plus. You. Uh, it's, oh, sorry. It's like plus uh, eight. My bad. Yeah, That's... sorry. It doesn't. It doesn't show it on Foundry the way I'm using. No, it's all good. Um. So, um. In what is the rudimental attacking? Uh, all on the small guy. Okay. Um. So it's gonna be. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, you're just gonna watch as this thing is just, <laughs> just slamming down and just immediately. Oh, crush this thing. Will be. Trust me. Sug. I mean, I should probably save the rest of the dust for cool things. Uh, God. Uh, yeah. I'm a. I don't want to step away from it though. I mean, it's gonna hit me anyways, right? Probably. There's a one in four chance it hits. I haven't done shit to it, so it's acid. not. Yeah. yeah, probably higher because I was also its first one that it made contact with. I'll try to escape. I'll... Oh wait, no. I yeah, mean, yeah. if you give me a, I mean, yeah, no, it's probably. It's probably worth. It's I mean, there's no way this goes terribly wrong. I run away from him. Okay. He raises up the neuron X and. <laughs> Oh, oh, it's oh, the man. It's got oh, terribly wrong. wrong. <laughs> 27 oh. points of damage just <laughs> as this crackling beam axe just <laughs> just slashes <laughs> straight down. Damn. I'm going to say they're scarring down your back now as the, the, the searing, burning oh, axe just gashes down the, the back of your suit. Hey, Zuck, <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> God, why? I told you. You didn't tell me anything. I don't want to say I pushed it away from you for a reason either, but um. What the bozo. I hope you're okay. Bob gives him the thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, sort of just like uh low effort and just trying to like retaliate in his own way. I'm just going to start sending scrap flying at him. Okay. Uh, 14 will not hit, but the 8 will. As you just see, it kind of hit it. Just its head flies back a little bit, and it goes back to its normal pose. 
<laughs> uh, dog bot activate. <laughs> Boo. 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 You're like, of course he did. <laughs> <laughs> of course I net one and they net 20. <laughs> this is D and D. This is D and D. And so as the the, the, the bot just kind of looks at you right away, it goes to pursue and then just bumps into uh, bumps into Drask. And you'll see the uh. head just kind of look down. It holds up the axe and it just begins slashing down. Oh, with oh. The, another crit. Dear God, this guy's got a I'd stop. like oh, to, oh, oh. Brett, I'd yes. like to use my reaction to... Uh, she flicks her wrist and uh, intercepts uh, the axe with her axe, uh, reducing the damage that he's going to take by 1d10. Ah, let's see it. Uh, oh, yeah. All right. <laughs> <laughs> so, in that so instead of instead, oh, Jesus. instead of forty two, you will take forty points of damage. <laughs> hey man. And another fifteen. Yeah. What? And the you're hell? also watching as. Uh, Wait, isn't he raging? He's raging so. Oh, yeah. th no, this is radiant damage. Is it is not reduced. Oh, oh, oh shit. Wait, okay, is it let's go. Or is it radiation? It's radiant, it's as radiant. in it's, radiant. it's, it's okay. sheer energy just burn. That's why I'm saying like Zug's getting some scarring and Drask, you okay. are with absolutely. Uh, okay, ooh, ooh, ooh. All right. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I, I'm gonna make a, I'll make a roll. Uh, I'm gonna roll to see where you're, you're gonna scar, where your the ooh, axe is gonna slash yes. down. Holy shit! All right. Ooh. All right. So. All right, that's not so bad. Uh, it's gonna tear through. Okay, so it is kind of bad. Uh, it's gonna tear through your um, your your leather, like, like the the armor that you have on, as it just kind of like just completely burns and sears through. And this, and in its wake, you're just gonna see this charred, blackened slash mark diagonally against your whole torso. Ooh, kick ass! Give me another. But you have one on your on your uh, front, and I have one on my back. Yes, that's so sick, brother. <laughs> that's awesome, actually. Holy shit! And then yeah, when you say "give me an," and it just the energy just slashes against her face, doesn't scar, but you immediately feel the searing pain of the axe. Oh, oh, and and then it's trying to push, but it can't. And then at as Bo goes. Uh, the beam just goes off again, just and it has no way to escape because of this narrow hallway. So, uh, the beam goes off again. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and check real quick what it was. Where are we? Moonbeam, boom, 2d10. Yeah, you're just gonna watch as this thing just continues to blast. The shield is unable to, to build around it as it takes another 12 points of damage. Bo, it's your turn. I'm not entirely sure what to do. I've been looking at my spells, and if I'm holding concentration, I can't really do anything else at all. Any other all. concentration spell, that's correct. Yes. Um, and is that starting to, to frustrate you a little bit? No, no, not at all. I just don't, I'm not much help. I can as, start running over. But... As, it's, as the uncertainty is sort of like coming over you of what exactly you can do, your entire body begins to writhe in pain. Huh? What? <laughs> the bomb. I, only they got hit. We're the ones that got hit. hit. And then uh, everyone that is looking, you'll just watch as Bo will fall just torso first into the ground, and you'll just watch as all parts of his flesh is just convulsing and like surging up towards his back and it's almost as if his body is just inflating you hear like oh, wait okay i got this huh 
Yep, just muffled, just a, a muffled. Guys, I think Bo's exploding. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, Bo, I have to end your round there. But something will happen to you next round. Oh, good lord. Oh, this is cool. All right. Elsie. Okay. Uh, I think watching Dress take that very, very heavy hit, uh, Felsic is going to enter her rage almost defensively. Yeah. Uh, and I am going to deliver two reckless attacks to the yes. large man, robot man. Both hit as you are just beginning to cleave apart Ooh, this wow. ancient Bra- technology. Bra- Bra- <laughs> well done. Mm-hmm. And then that will also be three. All right. And as you as you're slashing, you'll begin to feel yourself. Just the wounds are opening up on, on you as well as you continue to inflict these strong attacks against this creature. Drask. Drask is fucking smiling huge right now. Eyes obscured by his flames. Um, and he's gonna reckless attack as well. Following that. Okay. Um, that... I'm guessing this thing doesn't bleed, so I'll still flame. Yep, that hits. Ooh. And then I will also off uh, offhand attack recklessly. Uh, sneak attack as well. Oh, sneak. That's right. I always forget. I have too many dice. Sneak was bad. Hey, offhand crit, though. Good mm-hmm. stuff. And yeah, you're just going in and just beginning to tear it apart. And this thing um, is just that's all. convulsing as well as it's sparking there. Damn it, not enough. The bomb. Uh, this, I mean, currently right now, Bo's inflating. Right? Just watching that's as like, Bo is that? inflating like and growing <laughs> right now. Okay. Uh... Bomb doesn't know anything about actual medicine, but he, I think he'd assume that something bad's happened <laughs> to Bo. All right, do they look like in pain? I'm yes. guessing. Yes. I mean the the bombs. I mean, he's got, I think he's gonna use his bonus action to try to heal Bo with like irradiating his radiation thing, like like just pure RP. I feel like. Yeah. Like in or out of combat, I, that'd be what he'd do. So I'm gonna use my bonus action to use radi- like uh, I guess like half of my radiation regeneration. Up, uh, okay. So as you hold out and begin, uh, how uh, how many do you use? I'll use twelve of my twenty. Okay. So as you get there, um, Lena, are you back? Uh, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Cool. Awesome. Awesome. Just making sure. So as the radiated energy goes over, uh, as it makes contact with Bo, it it goes into hyperdrive and the inflation and the growth just rapidly concludes itself at that point. Um, so no graphic yet, uh, but Bo would transform into a Bobination. Oh my <laughs> god. As no, you, what? As you just watch as this heavy, bloated, almost scaled over Bo just approaches uh, with two legs, maintaining concentration. As a bowmination, you are able to bite and punch. Uh, you are also able to do a heavy attack, and your heavy hide allows you to add your constitution modifier to your AC. Cool. Wow. I fixed them, or made them worse. <laughs> what have you done? I do not know. Nor do I think I'm taking responsibility for this. So you're you're gonna see as the Bomination can talk, but it, it's a very deep and girdled sound. Oh God! Uh, <laughs> this is, uh, look, I got an XLR, but then I'm fucking. T- oh, you don't have to do that. Just you can do it. Just like a, you can do whatever you want. It's just a deep and just heavy sound. If that's what, like just it's very just weighted. <laughs> that works. Uh, Go on, tell him this isn't my fault. (laughs) This isn't. See? (laughs) Uh, 
Oh my god, but whose bomb is it? <laughs> I don't know. The bomb's going to use his action to shoot two beams at the like, robot. Uh, first is 12, second is a 16. 16 will hit, dealing seven points of damage. Uh, and then the Radimental, who apparently is supposed to be medium size, so we can be shrunk a little bit. Okay, sure. We're just, yeah, uh, we're just using a temporary token for now. Yeah. Uh, yes, we'll also kind of like go in with the attack. And yeah, you'll just kind of watch as the nice. Radimental like leaps in and just kind of, you'll see a bright radiation like explosion kind of like go off the chassis of this, of this, this creature. And, uh, yeah, it, the parts will immediately fall right there, ending Woo. the encounter. Yeah. Nice. All right. What the hell is that thing behind me? <laughs> oh. oh, man. And you'll watch now that the threat seems to de-elevate a little bit. As a bow, you will revert back to normal flow, like immediately just deflate back to your normal size. And hey. you're good. What happened? Uh, initiative's over, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, Zug's gonna sort of be <laughs> just looking on in, I want to say horror, but like also fascination and curiosity uh, at Bo. But I also, I gotta be right back for that thing that I told you about earlier. So be okay. right back. Understood. Oh, uh, Brett, just to clarify something super quick. Uh, yes. My rage can just end naturally after like a minute, right? Yes, but you inflict damage upon yourself for every time you don't attack something during that. So oh, you, yes, okay. So if you want to end so will, your primal rage, you'll take 2d6 and it ends it. Yeah, which is like much, much less than taking. Yes, correct. <laughs> yeah, right, okay, I'll take uh, I'll take 2d6 then. All right, another six points of damage dealt to you. All right, cool. As your primal rage will subside. And then we'll wait for Lawman. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. What happened to the other droid? Did I miss it? Because oh, I shot that one oh, so died hard, it so exploded. Quick. Yeah. Oh, yeah. awesome. Okay. Yeah, it got it got killed pretty quickly. It got Eldritch blasted. You see. Mm -hmm. As you do. As, As you do. The warlock you, you blast, tends to blast. do. So while uh, while that's happening, what are you all doing as this thing just falls down over there? Hmm. We're uh, standing. I think the bomb's more worried about Bo than the thing. I, I like remember and know what happened, right? Like I'm full memory of it. Like, yes. Like, aware. Yes. Okay. Yeah, that seems normal to me. <laughs> that was cool. What happened? Huh? I mean, I don't know. But I, I don't will know. say it's not my fault if it was a bad thing, and if it's a good thing, I did it. <laughs> I guess I will find out. Are you good? Yeah, hey, that was that was neat. Did you, did you see that? That was cool, huh? I don't, I don't know what happened, but, you know. Yeah, you know. Mm, I want to take apart this old world fucking bot. Yeah. I hate it. I hate robots. So you just start they tearing apart this robot. No, no, I'm like gently taking off its limbs and stuff. I I don't know. Like I haven't seen anything like this before, right? Old Correct. world tech? Correct. Yeah, so I'm figuring that some of it might be, you know, something that could be salvaged. Okay. I'm just uh, getting a little head start on it. Okay. Sounds good. You start to work on the metal container and then Lawman, what happens? Damn, I was hoping he was gonna like walk right Damn. in there. Like, <laughs> well, I was see, like, what? While, while that's still happening, I think. Is, Brett, is this door like a sealed kind of like space <laughs> door? As you approach it, it just opens up for you. Oh, it's automated. Oh, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. Why is there nothing in there? No, it's just opening automatically on its own. Oh, you're not okay. doing that? No. Yeah, I mean, it's an automated door. Like, this whole place is automated. Let's check it out. I gotta, like, time my run in there? No, you don't have to do anything. Well, I mean, I just, just thought I was gonna... I was gonna try to look in there beforehand, but I don't think I'll be able to. 
two doors. What? Wait. Uh, I kind of maybe it's Squeeze an airlock. In. I uh, da, 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 da. what? What? Uh. No, it's just a beautiful garden. What? Inside, you'll see nice. what seems to be some sort of, uh, almost like some sort of botany bay. Huh. Ooh. Is that a pool or is that a table? Uh, a it, pool. It is not a pool. No. <laughs> but it, it appears to be some sort of screen, almost like a shard screen, but the, it seems a little different. Huh. Well, I want to... I, I, I want to look at the shard screen, see what it like says, you know? <clears throat> so as you're looking through, all right, and Bo just runs in. So Bo, as you <laughs> charge headfirst into the oh, into no. the nature observatory, uh, you will see a giant ice block over here. So you watch as Bo just kind of like runs over to the tree and then Felsic, what are you doing? Uh, so you're trying um, to like make contact with the screen, correct? Yeah. So as you're touching the screen, nothing appears to be activating, and the material itself even feels different than the shard technology that you're used to. And then you look down and recognize that there seems to be a series of keys over here, like buttons that you can press. Oh. Um. Hey, Bo, are you gonna are you gonna come back? Hey, uh, you want me to come back? I can come back. Yeah, I just kind of want to press some buttons, but I don't know if I'm going to, like, accidentally electrocute you or cover you in... Why don't you press the button and I'll tell you what happened. This is a terrible idea, Bo. She, what if it I don't blows know, the she tree slams up? Or, a nice like, looking button and she slams, like, a nice one. <laughs> Are you sure about this? Uh-oh. Huh? You'll watch at Bo as the block of ice before you immediately thaws as a creature starts lurking and you just kind of hear the sound of ice and then you'll hear You'll see the creature form as it begins to approach you, maw open wide, as a Tyrannosaurus Rex oh, dear God. begins <laughs> charging what? over to you. Huh? And it's just, hey. it, and it just goes <laughs> as it yells out over. You'll just see its head bow down to you, and it just looks like it's about to swallow you up. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. Hey, that and that was a bad button, huh? That was that, the nicest button, huh? And that is where we will leave <laughs> off with today's session. Of Bo's Ice dead. Dreamers. Until next time Until on Pipe Dreamers. I'm gonna throw that. <sighs> yeah, next time. Yo, Ball man's gonna be pissed. It's a, we, it's a dinosaur ship, guys. <laughs> Dude, this is so cool. I love dinosaurs. I really wouldn't have asked for it to be any other way. <laughs> I hope you like their stomach, dude. Uh, I want to go inside their stomach and then rip it out. While I, I can't like, wait till Lawman comes back and we're just all like, hey, there's a there's a T-Rex in there. I'm like, what? <laughs> <laughs> Why was it in an ice cube? Why? Yeah, so. Mm. A very excited. Hey, back. And we're done. Hey, sorry. Buddy. Sorry. Should have waited for you. We're sorry. done. We're Dinosaurs, bro. Uh, Yo, there's a <laughs> Dinosaurs, bro. <laughs> what are you talking about? I went off again. I was gonna get eaten <laughs> by a Tyrannosaurus oh. Rex. How? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, wait for like one minute. I was gone for one minute. <laughs> Where is it? I don't. I don't see it on the map. Uh, because it is over here in this lovely little botanical garden. And Felsic oh. pressed a button, and it activated the exhibit with a Oh, we had to decision. find out somehow. I'm around the corner. <laughs> <laughs> well, we really killed that robot. We're great. <laughs> All about teamwork. Yeah. Uh, it's good to be uh, back, boys. Good to be back. Oh, uh, yeah. It's time for some fan art. Yeah, I miss mm. this. But first.
We're gonna do bingo, otherwise chat will Oh, that's also money. a thing. That is also a thing. <laughs> Get rid of these pipe dreamers. And bring forth our pipe dreamers IRL. Hey, there's everyone, except for Lena. Hold on one second. I'm back. You are back. Lena, I want a T-Rex, guys. Did anyone see that new movie with Kylo in it? And it, it it's bad. What? I didn't give you a chance to say oh, yes. That's a like, lot that, that you just eight. went through. No, I don't <laughs> want to. Did anyone see said, that movie 65? with Kylo? It doesn't bad. have a name. <laughs> well, it's 65. Kylo Ren oh, and dinosaurs. Oh, with the with the dinosaurs. I haven't seen it's it. No. So, it's so bad. It's so bad. Which one is I this? I like dinosaurs. It's literally just called 65, where he lands on Earth to fight dinosaurs uh, with guns. Cool, no, cool. No, thank you. The dinosaurs have guns, or he fights it with his own guns. guns is no, the thing. thank you. Yeah. Oh, like, sorry. Like... Adam Driver. Yeah, yeah. That, yeah, you said Kylo Ren. I knew who you were talking about. <laughs> Actually, no, you didn't say <laughs> Kylo, Kylo Ren? Ren. You just said Kylo. You said, Kylo. You said the one is with it like, Kylo okay, in it. Okay. This is a really important clarification. Is it like... <laughs> disaster movie bad where it's like a bad movie but it's like really fun to watch like the carnage and destruction there's not even really carnage or destruction it's just like bah also, dinosaur and he's like pew 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 pew, pew. glad also, that's over also lol man like, here's the shot as i'm uh, sharing the screen oh discord crashed that was pretty epic hi everyone discord said no hi oh. <laughs> hey what's up discord Dis this yeah discord just died for everyone it seems that's okay Aww. that's badass that is badass. Uh, Wait, who's Kylo Ren? Why did I say Kylo Ren? You, because <laughs> that's Adam. Are you fucking? Are you fucking with me right what? now? No, <laughs> no, no. This Wait, why did I say Kylo Ren? Because, because that's that's really you really said really Adam really Driver, really which is Kylo Ren from Star Wars. What are you talking? What do you know? Hold on. Oh, Kylo is the Star Wars thing. I always thought that was his name for the longest time. Okay, Adam. Driver. <laughs> you thought Adam Driver's name was <laughs> Kylo? <laughs> you can't be real. Oh, Lena. Oh, sweet child. Oh, that's amazing. I have COVID. <laughs> you Listen, can't guys, I have use COVID. that excuse every time. But I'll, I'll give you the COVID yeah, card for like that a, one. You get like three more. I have COVID. Yeah, I'll give you, honestly, for that, I will give you the COVID card. Okay. This is my favorite actor, Joker Kylo? 2018 Joker. <laughs> it was actor. wild that Indiana Jones was in Star Wars. Yeah. Like, my like favorite days. actor, Kylo. Kylo Adam Driver. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Um, oh no. No, that was great. Uh, let me share the screen and hopefully I don't crash all of uh, Discord again. And also, Lawman, you can go ahead and take a look at the battlefield and see exactly what happened. Oh no. <laughs> nice. <laughs> really? Why, why? So, okay, I'm guessing it wasn't plainly visible when Bo was first approaching. No. Uh, Bo saw a giant mm -mm. frozen block. And then we touched well, buttons because we're smart. Oh, okay. I didn't see blocks. I said there was a giant frozen under the trees. We I pushed the nicest after. looking button to our defense. No push. I did ask if he wanted to come back before I started pressing buttons. Yeah, but <laughs> yeah, I was given true. many opportunities to get out of that room and even suggested that they stay in while this happened. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, bingo. I was about to do fan art. What the fuck am I doing? I'm getting so I the the dis the Discord disconnecting just threw me for a fucking loop. Okay, here we are. There it is. Let's, the hunt for oil. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Party on the ship. Party on no. Not yet. They wreck havoc on the station. I will continue that from the Clarent Mart. Uh from before. No combat, nopers. Uh, Brett takes emotional damage. Uh, yes. When don't you? Je but just now with uh, Kylo Adam Driver. That, that, <laughs> that shook me. <laughs> Something fierce. <laughs> we got nat, nat one. Uh, no Zug shrugs. Or No, there was a Zug. There was a few Zug shrugs at the, mm. the, the ship mart, I thought. Was there? Oh, no. You were just mm. disappointed. It wasn't shrug. That's it was right. it was slumped yeah, It's just down. an implied shrug. That's not good enough. I, I, I'm not some sort of one-trick pony here. I, I appreciate that, man. Like, I I admire you going for the genuine bingo. Uh, cursed RP. Yes. 100%. I'm not even going to... Yes. Fucking microwave the hedgehog. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is curses we're about to get. <laughs> New armor and weapons. So, no. Missile no. launcher. 
Pistol. That's a yep, that, that's a new weapon. Chopping RP, nodders. Bomb teaches Mido an important lesson. Uh, no, I don't think so. Not today. Okay. Felsic collecting more W's. More? When is she not? <laughs> Has she ever collected one? <laughs> I mean, I like to think you're all collecting W's and L's mutually, so yeah. Felsic spends a lot of money. <laughs> Personal uh, prediction, we oh are getting space hamsters. We Free could space. have. Felsic finds a hobby. <laughs> oh, somehow you, we managed. To well, that yeah, we dodged that one. Yeah, <laughs> Falsic smokes the weed. TM. I almost started making little hedgehog hats. <laughs> <laughs> they get spacesuits. Yes, the Clarent Mart mascot returns. <laughs> yes, Felsic yeah. and Zug Walnock. No. Oh, I'm sure it happened. No, it didn't. You have to well, no, it. not. But like, you I'm sure you did. Say so. You didn't explicitly say so. <laughs> yeah, you gotta no, say so. No, just like within the like, canon, I'm happened. sure it did. No, no, no. That's a <laughs> that's a dangerous game we'd be playing if we if we went with that. So nope. All right, uh, facade encounter. No rack rolling. No. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. That's a bingo. I would say anytime. Anytime Bo just runs into a room, we're doing some rack roll. Right <laughs> happened there. a few times. Yeah, so that definitely is the rack roll moment. They make it to the abandoned station right at the end of the session. No, more rats. Uh, kind of because that you could buy them. Someone drinks radiator fluid. No, Beer. downtown. I got a ton of it. Yeah, and then downtime ship shenanigans. Not exactly, but we did get a bingo bongo. All nice right, nice job. Good bingo. Good job. All right, fan bongo. artists. I know we've got a lot of fan art to go through. I oh will my say God. this. Two weeks. I, I, there is one thing I like about uh, weeks off is that next week's fan art is crazy. Ooh. It is crazy. I will say, though, if there is any uh, microwaving of hedgehogs, I would nope. request you delete those now because if I see them, you'll be banned <laughs> from the server. So this is your heads up that if you Look thought you were done. pulling a dark you're funny, <laughs> you're not. So you have time now to delete. I'm going to the fan art now. You got to talk to him. <laughs> <laughs> you have been given ample warning now. All right. <laughs> okay. All right. Hold on. Hold on. Holy shit. All right. So I'm going to double check, um, but I think it did start from here. Uh, and this is amazing. I, I really okay. do. No, Yo, no. why are you so thick? What, what the, the hell? hell? <laughs> don't, don't know why it took us there, but here we what are. The let's, heck? let's try that again. Thick boy. Uh, ah, here we are. Uh, the many personalities of, the many personalities of Felsic. Aww. <laughs> You're all over the place. This is this is this is yeah. You're a wreck. Pull it's yourselves you. together. Wreck Rock rocket ship. <laughs> no. Cute. It's like Record. it's like pipe dream babies over here when everyone's at like the nursery. Wreck <laughs> and then we've got of course young adult fell sick. Aw, cute. She would wear a beanie. So. I love the style. <laughs> Jug and a dress. Jug and a dress. Whoa. <laughs> Jug and a Oh, cute. cute. Yeah. Cute. <laughs> Flex. <laughs> it's canonical sizes. That's true, yeah. And it's Aww, that's so cute. <laughs> the mascot dude came uh -oh. back. Oh, bro, look at him. It's full of brass. like Clarence. Bo is not real. <laughs> oh yeah. I try okay. to RP Lena, I try to RP as you and everyone said you weren't actually there and that I yeah, uh, I, we yeah. we did an RP where your character did not come to that small room. Yeah, it was like a you were like a collective tulpa for a little yeah. while. There was a gas leak, you see. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Uh got a little plant mart vapor with the pickle flavor, of course. Pickle vape. Did. There we go. <laughs> Good shit. Fuck. Whoa. 
Oh, yeah. yeah. This is great. Hell yeah. The squad. Steal some looks, partner. Yeah. <laughs> Nuclear waste. They're <laughs> free. That's just, that's just free. Inherit. Hey, Bob, Bob, what's up with that? <laughs> it's an honorary badge. Dr. Sushi gave it to me. <laughs> so cursed. <laughs> Look at these rages. Oh my god! Damn. Damn. We look so cool. Great, great right here. Season 2, Session 3. Bo jumps into to the, 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 the mouth. Oh That's no. This pretty much happened today, too. Yeah. That's not okay. I didn't, I didn't know when it came <laughs> <laughs> That wasn't there when I was there. <laughs> this ain't about him. Hashtag right on. <laughs> you didn't say howdy back. I never do. Sleepy rack. Oh, Aww. We're so cute. What could be? Oh, I don't no. like that. No. Rancid. Howdy, partner. Oh, okay, guys, get ready. This is a little extreme. Uh oh. Oh! <laughs> you, guys, oh! you guys gotta oh! stop! Holy shit! What the fuck? This is oh, so good. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Holy shit. Got a little Ooh, animation whoa. to this. Yeah, pretty good. The heck? Love That's it. Good. That's good. Fire hair. <laughs> Aww. Very right. good at dancing, actually. Believe it or not. <gasps> Aww. Just a couple of teens. They're so cute. Oh, no, drop kick. Mm. Drop kick him. <laughs> Pick him up. Oh, oh. stop. <laughs> yeah. oh. They're called scrap mantises. I love this little lore that you're putting into the world. The scrap mantis. Oh, so yeah. cute. So, oh, no. Um, food. What the? <laughs> okay. no. Hungry. Apparently, a bunch of scrap bugs were made. That's. Oh, cool. I love them. Oh. It's amazing. I hate the centipede with the mouth, but I love that I hate it. Hey, yo, they oh, rage. Wow. Whoa. Dude, we're so cool. Great. That we goes so, so much hard. Ass. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> For real, <laughs> it just loops like that. Just loops. This is what we do. This is what we do. You know. <laughs> so good. Yeah, that's perfect. That is literally. I love it. <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay, that's cute. Where are we oh. going? <laughs> oh, <laughs> we're gonna go dig God. through the garbage. Oh my god. That's Look, so cute. He needs the eye patch. You can't the eye patch is see. so good. No, here. Oh. No. <laughs> oh. <What>? Married. <laughs> little dancing. Little dress. <laughs> Wait, did I you like get an that. eye patch while I like I was the gone? use of these eye patches. Uh, at the end of the, the set, last session that you were at, uh, it got. He bla he, his eye shot off, but then his it grew eye back. Got but shot he still off. got it grew an eye back, patch. but he still put on an eye, uh, yeah, an eye patch. Yeah, I have an eye patch now. Oh. It's badass. Mm -hmm, very, mm -hmm. very good. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, is that Skagzag up there? Oh, oh, right. Among us. Oh, is that, is, 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 is that the creature? <laughs> I hate pots! <laughs> oh, here we go. Why is this so nice in the background? Is that him again? Get him out of these family photos. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Look how sassy he is. Cute. Yeah, I'm, I'm sassy. You're a little sassy. Oh. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Where is he keeping his book, Lena? Where is he keeping his book? <gasps> Carefully jumps on console of a hastily put together. 
<coughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Sad. Yes. Oh. A redhead literally ripped out his heart. There he is, the desperado. Oh. There he is. Mm. Oh, this one's great with the fire. That looks Ooh. awesome. I need more rage pictures. Is that head full of soup? Mm, I'm just thinking about a bowl of chili. That's oh, right, God. bowl of chili. <laughs> mm. There he is. <laughs> Good. That's so cute. Oh, adorable. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my oh. gosh. Yeah. Oh, adorable. Hmm. Oh, my. Oh. oh. His eye, dude. Oh, my eye. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> no. <terrible>. We can't. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Please. Stop it. Oh, I love oh. it. Oh, oh, I fancy little lad. Back when he still wore clothes. Remember, I picked out an outfit for him. Remember? And 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 then you just threw it all away. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <Yeah. laughs> nice. That's a good shit post. Uh, and I love this this <laughs> cannon. This. Oh. 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 Yes! Yes! Spicy. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Good expressions. Badass! Oh, we look so cool. Uh, dude, and this actually goes sick. That, I actually really like that one. That's the, the fucking... I love Jurassic. Forward boys. I love Jurassic's Ooh, new look with the horns. Long hair. Me too. Long I'm, hair, I'm never getting rid of him. That's what you think. No! You can't do this to me! Why does she get horns now? <laughs> I'll roll into them eventually. Right on. <laughs> oh, oh my yeah. god. Oh hell yeah. What am I looking at here? What is oh, that? a little jello. <laughs> Love it. Muffles screaming. So yeah. we all saw this, but everyone needs to watch this because we're going to watch it again. So. Oh, yes. The video. Here we go. It's so funny. Just, just, just. Do the, I'm gonna do the hand underneath the door as long as there's space. There is space. There is space and hand under door. Scope it out quick with my eyes. Make sure there's nothing like crazy going on. Hey, this is another safe. Office. But there is a safe. Huh. I know what those are. Partner. Open <laughs> 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 the door over there. <laughs> that is safe. Wait a minute. Safes? Keep things safe. Oh my god, I just got that. Aww. You should open it and take what's inside. You're so smart. It is a uh, safe that has a combination lock. How do I, where do I stick these? <sighs> Bo has really big ears, and I watched a movie once where they put their ears <laughs> on the safe. He face plants his face forward <laughs> into the safe. Now, can we attempt to blast Wait. open the safe? You bring this home, is it bolted? Hey, maybe this is one of those puzzles where, like, the code is in, like, another room. There yeah. is nothing in any of the other Wait. rooms. Well, that I check this desk. You. What if there's, like, a letter in this desk, like a note with just four okay, numbers that on it? That would be really convenient. You see a stray piece of paper taped under it. You see it, it's a series of numbers. Maybe <laughs> the combination. This is garbage. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, garbage. Yeah. When I read these numbers, yes. do they mean anything? <laughs> I don't know, <laughs> but I feel like Brett already gave you. No, I mean, in terms of, uh, is this a phone number here? It appears to be four numbers spaced mm. apart. Mm. This is not today's date. Is it a bank account? I think. <laughs> I don't want to go home. I'm getting tired. Okay, wait a minute. <laughs> oh. This is crazy, but let me see that safe. Holy <laughs> shit, Zog, you're literally so smart. Thank you. And I begin putting in the numbers. Oh my god, would you believe it? The safe popped open. Yeah. Oh my god, that how the hell does that even work? Let me take a look inside. Inside, you find a gun. 
Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> it's so I good. I see another dude. safe. I know how it's to do really, that. really <laughs> the old classic spot. Nope. Banger. We're screwed, guys. Yeah, that was Get 10 out, out of 10. Alright, I love that. <laughs> yeah, that was good. Go ahead and good follow stuff. Sevi TV. Uh, who has done other uh, IO animations as well? Good stuff. Thank you again for that. Good stuff. Good stuff. Yes. What the? Fuck? <laughs> ah, yes. Original, mm. food. original artist fan art. Wow. <laughs> That's right. Uh, Mariah did this. Ooh. Yeah, I would not use that food dispenser. Yeah, it's kind of <laughs> gross. I mean, we've been using it since, but. Yeah. Oh my god. Great. There's so much here. So much happening. It's it's wonderful. Am I posting with the sad slime? I like how she's just saying, GET FUCK! <laughs> get fucked. <laughs> fuck! Get <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, oh no! I'm so pretty! <laughs> God damn, that is a jawline for crunching bone. <laughs> you got weed? <laughs> Ten, Ten credits. Little <laughs> slug cat. Well, might have that is happened. very cool. <clears throat> it finally happened. Good job. Oh no. <laughs> we we <laughs> did it. <laughs> we found <laughs> the Among Us. Whoa. Oh, that is cool. Whoa. <laughs> oh, shit. That's gonna be fun. That goes hard. Soon. Yeah, too. Yeah. Oh, whoa. Now that goes hard. That goes hard. <laughs> <laughs> it took me like a fucking whole minute to see that was <laughs> Yeah, man. <laughs> Foam and denser foam. Oh, this cool. is cool and fucking terrifying. <laughs> oh, oh my god, my god. that is, is what that, the heck? This art is a like statement. Oh, yeah, uh -oh. Is, I don't like that. Is, that is oh, what it no. would look like, huh? This oh, art hard. is a statement. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh no, this can't. It can't be. Oh. <laughs> Yo, she's got the Tims. Holy the Tims shit. and the hat always get larger for our characters. Every oh time. Oh my god, that's that's cool. That's cool. Damn. Look at that. Oh. Hate it. I hate it. I like Damn. this. Aww. I love this. Whoa! <laughs> Why does everybody have an ass today? It had to work. <laughs> when, you, when you got two weeks, all right, I bet that one. All right, <laughs> now it's time for the microwave fan art. Here we go. Oh, no, no, microwave. <laughs> so concludes the microwave fan art. Damn, oh, I wonder if there's a lot of deleted posts. Banking. <laughs> 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 It's wild because I thought about my bank account in game earlier that... today. I was like, I wonder if that's like, I wonder if that works yeah. in space. Yeah, I believe that's that off. like a district bank. Yeah, because that that <laughs> moment you were just like, I don't have a. Oh my god, I do. You're not going. Microwave! You're not going oh to god. microwave it, right? Look at him. <laughs> I mean, he looks so cute. Microwave. <laughs> microwave. Oh, cute. cute. I do not have the emotional knowledge nor capabilities <laughs> to deal with it. <laughs> Just put that in a bottle. Hypothetically. <laughs> Hypothetically. <laughs> that was great. <laughs> oh. I love that short that, that, that shortkeeper. Wow. Shopkeeper. Wow. Yeah. At that store. They're great. <laughs> a lot of hypothetically. That line resonated with some people. Put those damn horns away. She's cute, man. I'm going to say it. You're so jealous, dude. Please I am. type the number, you dumb, dumb man. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the classics, baby. Woo! God <laughs> damn. That's a good one. I liked that vacation, but I'm glad we're back. Whoa, 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 whoa. Iconic. I can't go back to minimum wage. <laughs> I just don't. I just don't think Felsic really got it. You know what I mean? You can never. You had money. I just don't think Bert, that's it. great. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to talk about this? Help, help me. <laughs> help, help, help. Help. Look, there's nothing wrong with wanting to like take money from your friends in D and D for like like really no reason other than just to take it from them. I don't. Think that's <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, help. Boy. 
Help. Help. Aww. The littlest guy. Look at him. Yeah, look Aww. at that little dwarf twerp. Hey guys. Pick that like a thing Funko up. Pop. Just fucking huck it over the wall. <laughs> do, not, <laughs> do not kick Tiny Zug. What the fuck? <laughs> what is my purpose? <laughs> so sad. <laughs> Damn, that is kind of sad. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus god, Christ. Damn. Hypothetical NP art. NPC art. Let's go. I, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, she was fucking cute. Yeah. And, and people, <laughs> the artists agree. I got money. Robert can't pay. I got money. <laughs> <coughs> Oh, you took a tumble to Ganymedians? I know. What are you talking about, man? <laughs> God, you're so Whoa. dumb, man. Oh, my God. Whoa, Jesus. I feel something. We got to. Yeah. Gotta, all we, right. Hold yeah. on. We're, we're on to something. We found <laughs> something here. Oh, I'm going back to that shop. I mean, right there has heavy armored feet and no heavy armor. Cringe. Is this? Hey. Yo, this is a call out post. Is this? Is this? Is this? Is this, is this rules lawyering backseating through fan art? I think so. <laughs> they circumvented. <laughs> That's this incredible. Is first. I have to this go to the council. Galaxy, you gotta applaud the hustle. Oh wow. Wow. <laughs> you can I tell am. this has been eating at them. Holy <laughs> shit. They and saw I, it two weeks ago and they were like. This is Zuck's time. This is his fucking time. <laughs> and then they watched this stream and just got angrier and angrier. The balls. <laughs> played out under the canvas. The balls. Just... Jesus I, uh, Christ. Hey, check this out. Check this yeah. out. You guys are gonna like this. I don't care. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah! Whoa! Oh, wow! Oh, wow! Oh, wow! Yeah! She's right. so mad, dude. She's so mad. <laughs> This, He's typing in the Discord. You, you guys in chat can't see it. This will be the one and only. Oh, shit. World he sent lawyer like seven messages. I don't even post. have time to read these. If any of you do this again, you're you're out. You're out. Oh my god, he typed. This is paragraphs. How are you doing this? I mean, your WPM is insane. Thanks, guys. Uh, good boy protocol activated. Aw, good boy. Tusk? Oh. Tusk. Oh, Tusk. <laughs> I, just, I, I thought it was Tusk, Tusk. like the movie. <laughs> no. Moonbeam. Oh. Yeah, that's wicked. Do you see the wicked. <laughs> no. No. This can't be happening. That's not what I wanted. This. Please stop. Oh. Time to get that scar, or time to get Oh, that the scar, scar too, art. holy shit, dude. Yes, yes. Bomination, it's time. Oh, God. You know, I kind of hope I don't look like that. That's a little bit, that's, a little, that's good, you know? Huh. <laughs> hey, that's pretty rad. Whoa. That is rad. Oh my God, look at that radimental. Dude, wicked. <laughs> wicked. At least, <laughs> at least one stream. We were oh. so close. <laughs> to this the, my for, purpose. For being away from the voice.tm. We were so close. That's your purpose, dude. Zero days Nifty. without incident. Ooh. Oh. Oh, okay. That's cool. <laughs> I'm gonna throw you into a wall. <laughs> <laughs> That's uh, cute. Aw, here is uh, everyone as. Um... Oh, whoa! Wait, I love this. This is That's so cute. That's me as fuck. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Cool. I love Very Hollow Knight. Cool. Oh. Very cool, Hollow Knight. All right. That wraps up everything today. Thank you guys so much. Thank uh, you. Have to the top, man. Thank we, you. <clears throat> we'll be back next week. Sound good? Yeah, sounds very good. All right, see you guys then. Sounds the most excellent. Thank you. Bye-bye. Good night, everyone. Bye-bye.